it truly never fails. You, you are just, you're like, you know what? This is mine. We need to rename it. We absolutely need to rename it. It needs to be named like, uh, for double M's only. <laughs> hey, cat, how are you? We're, uh, we're looking at Ripley. She's, uh, she, do you, do you remember the first Toy Story with the claw and the little, the little alien guys and they're all in the, in the, the little grabber and they all look up and they're like, the claw knows who will go and who will stay. And they're just all like the claw. That's how she is about her heat bulb because it is directly like what, what she's looking at is the heat bulb and she's trying to figure out, is it food? Because it's not light. Is it food? I don't understand. Hi, Alex. How are you? Come on in. Snake stream! Snake stream. Uh, this will probably definitely be Ripley's last snake stream. Um, at least being, um, being the superstar. She... <sighs> lengthwise, she could. She is not strong enough to, that's in the first place. There are also things in the tank that she can climb on, like she can climb on that ball and stretch up to it. And also she has like a little shelf that um, has magnets that stuck to her back glass, but it's on the outside. And then we have a cutout on the lid. So it is safe. However, I don't want her to get up there and touch it because it is, it's in order for her, where she is right now, in order for that to be around 85 to 90 degrees, that bulb is about 500 degrees because it's it's so tall. So I would prefer her not being around it and just leave it alone. Rumi! Oh my god. I love cats so much. I do. I miss my cat. I miss my cat. It has been a while. I probably, if I got another cat, it will be a while from now. Yeah, um, it is winter here, but that doesn't mean anything. Um, the, uh, normally, like, like we're having a few colder nights, but that's it. If we didn't have any heating elements in any of the tanks, the tanks would sit around 70 four seventy six degrees, which is low. Um at, at least for them to be comfortable, it needs to be like high eighties or, or low eighties, and they can deal with that. Um and then when they're babies, what the fuck is Murphy doing? Murphy has discovered his his water bowl is big enough for him to get in, so he's been in it. And he's just like he's like a little duck right now. Um for the babies, their tanks do need to be a little bit more warm than normal, um, just because that's what they're used to at their breeder. That is Ripley. Have not switched anyone over yet. Um, the substrate, it was still a little moist this morning. And with snakes, it's very weird. Like if their substrate is too dry, they can get a respiratory infection. And it can it can be hard for them to uh, get ready to shed. And if it's too moist, I hate that word moist. Bleh, moist. Uh, if it's too moist, it can also cause uh, a respiratory infection, and it can cause um, something called scale rot, which is basically like a combination of like bed sores and and uh, what else like. It, it's basically where, like, you know, it's like if with, if with the if there's like something in your house that that stays wet for too long, it gets a mold on it. But this isn't mold. It's like it's rot. Like it, it's like you know, it's bad for snakes. So whenever someone says, "Should I get a ball python?" I'm always like, "Yeah, but no," because there's all of these little things that you have to keep track of. Like their temperatures have to stay like in the 80s and low 90s and it can't drop below that it definitely can't get above that and and their humidity has to like we have hygrometers 
I didn't know what a hygrometer was until I started getting snakes. Hygrometer, it tells me the humidity percentage and the temperature in the tank in that like ambient. And so all of the snakes have two, two in their tanks. The babies have one because their tanks are so small. And it's literally like just sitting there watching it. And like we have little mister, so uh, Queeb will mist down the tanks before he goes to bed if they look a little dry, if their humidity is like really dry. Uh, he, he has discovered his water bowl. That's good. He's such a dingbat. Uh, what is your what? So here it's. Yeah, it's nothing like that. When I say winter weather, I'm using quotey fingers and it's usually like. Uh, let's see. Let, let's see. Weather today for Los Angeles. Let, let's see what today's weather is. Oh, it's 61 degrees here right now. Possible drizzle. Um, yeah, like so far, the lowest it's been has been like maybe 55, but we've talked about this before on stream. We're kind of having this weird weather thing where it's like it'll start to get colder and overcast. And it's like, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. It's still summer. Never mind. JK. And then it'll be like 90 degrees. And then it'll slowly drop back down. And then, no, 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 well, hold on, hold on. Let's do it. Let's try to get summer again. And it's like on and on. We're on our eighth or ninth summer here. It's stupid. Like it's, <sighs> um, let's do, um, one Fahrenheit is Celsius. It is 16 degrees Celsius. Yes, I had I had to I had to translate that. <laughs> yeah, so we have uh cat, we have water bottles that have uh misters, but it's like they're fancy water bottles that I did again did not know existed until I got snakes. It's a continuous spray. It's like super super fancy. Like it it feels like like you you pump it once and it's just this just a very fine mist. It's super cool. Um, everything gets misted down. <laughs> Hi, Stahl. How are you? A little bit of schmoozing today. I'm not gonna lie. A little bit of schmoozing. Having Fahrenheit temperatures in place for me. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I will say this much. Queep has never had a moment where he's like, wait, what? what is the temperature? And like mentally translated it. Sergeant Nicer, hello. How are you? Um, I don't know. I have to, I have to say I think Texas is, but only I think California, Southern California is great. What is she, what the fuck is she doing? See, that's what that's what Murphy's doing right now. Except he's he's more lateral. What the fuck are they doing? They're nowhere near each other. How weird. Um, SoCal weather right now. It's it's good if you're not into extreme weathers, right? Like it's like a mild winter, a mild rainy season, a mildish summer, like like it's mild. And then um, I, I like Texas, I guess one, because I, I grew up there. I spent a lot of my life there, but it's like, oh, the sun was out this morning and it's a beautiful day. Not now, motherfucker, it's gonna be a thunderstorm. Like, oh, oh, you were having a really nice, mild winter? Psych! Hurricane coming at you, bitch. Like, it's every fucking extreme, sometimes thrown in all on the same day. I'm telling you, she is captivated by that, by her heat. Oh, she's trying to, is she trying to, like, backpedal into her, into her stupid little house? I looked, I tried looking for a um a small version or a, a medium version of that so her little log is barely big enough for her like her fat squeezes out the back she's super cute and then huxley has like a you've you've seen that one on stream i'm sure um it's probably like the size the base is the size of a dinner plate right there isn't one in between my uh 
my best friend is buying a, um, a 3D printer, and I actually happen to have an extra one of those little tree trunks. So I'm thinking of sending it to her instead of giving it to Archie, send it to my friend so they can scan it and size it up and 3D print one and see what happens. That's what I'm thinking I might do. I'm not sure. Negative two in Norway. Oh, post. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be straight with you. I'm craving some cold weather right now. Knock on everything wood. I don't want the electricity to go out. I'm just saying. I'm a little hot. I'm wearing a tie dye crop top and shorts. I have a fan on underneath me. I'm about to turn my fan on top. On. It's. It's a little warm. I would like it to be cold. Just a little cold. T Mans, how are you? How are you? Psycho doing the baby dance. I love that baby dance. It it it's so nonsensical. I think he needs a beanie. I really think he needs a beanie. Uh Brum or Broom. Please tell me how to say your name. I would love to say it properly. Good morning to Hungary. How are you? Uh, today's day 22. Day 22 of the, uh, Queebmas, Queebvent calendar, Queebsgiving, Queebtober, Queebentine's Day, Queebirthday, uh, Extravaganza Spectacular Variety Hour? Yeah, we're going to stick with that. Let's go with that. <laughs> um, we have a game today and I am excited about it. I am very excited about it. Yeah. I'm a little stoked. Um, I think it's a good one. I think he will like it. I think you will like it. It's a lot. <laughs> No, but hold on. I'm going to put that on my list. Whenever you guys keep recommending stuff, I put it on my list. And then I look it up um, to see what, like, to see gameplay and what the reviews are. And I'm going to try to slide some in. I've already done that a couple of times. Slime Rancher. And I've heard people keep talking about Slime Rancher. Hold on. Slime Rancher. Silly. You know what? There's no need to be anxious. There's no need. You know why? Because if you're going to die, you're going to die. And you can't stop it. But you're not going to die. You're going to be great. It's going to be fantastic. You're going to have fun. I'm assuming you're going to Philly for the holiday. In which case, it's going to be an amazing holiday. <laughs> we, we have some people... A, a, a little tiny, a little tiny bit scared of, of stuff like traveling. So you know what? It's you just got to face it. That sounds so morbid, but if it's going to happen, it's going to happen. And you worrying about it, you are seriously robbing yourself of your last precious moments worrying about the inevitable. Why? Why would you do that? If he dies, he dies. But no, you're going to be fine. You're going to be great. And you're going to come back and you're going to be like, y'all. I went, holy shit, I didn't die. I wish I did, though, but I didn't. Oh, there's a pink slime! Beatrix LeBeau, a plucky young rancher who sets out for life a thousand, year, a thousand light years away from Earth on the far, far range where she tries her hand at making a living wrangling slimes. Is this for real? Oh, this is cute! Oh, this is cute! I think the perspective would kind of freak me out just a little bit. I get... I have I have amazing direction, like IRL. Like, it, it's creepy how amazing it is. But in games, I'm like, I'm all over the place. I have no perception whatsoever. They do not make squishy sounds, Azusa. Don't tell me that. T Mans. Are you are you normally anxious about flying? 
Like, or is it just flying now? And I'm just going to say now in quotes because you know what I'm talking about. When you feed them, they squeak. Oh my god, what? I just opened the first Dr. Pepper of the day. I'm very excited. I'm very excited. It's so good. It's so good. I don't know why I'm on I'm on my Dr. Pepper ish. I'm normally not a not like I'm I'm normally someone who likes Dr. Pepper, but I'm like, Meh. Um. Yeah, I've been, I've kind of been, been, been digging it. There. I'm sorry. There's kitty cat slimes. Well, that's all you had to say. <laughs> that's amazing. Okay, hold on. There's so much going on. I need to. I need to. Grab the epic free game of the day. Because that's important. One. Where do I grab the game? They move the page that I usually go to to grab it. Has Queep played Death's Door? I have to see what the box looks like. Yes, I have to see what the box looks like. I said that. What are you going to do about it? Uh, Xbox, you want to load that for me? Okay, then don't, don't. It's cool, man. Like, don't. It's fine. I'll, I'll load it somewhere else. Don't even worry about it, bro. I. Oh, oh, is this with the, with the crow? This is with the crow. He has played this. Yes, he has played it. I don't recall if he liked it or not, but I do know he hasn't gone back. But at the time, when I walked in on him playing it, he did like it. I don't know if that means anything to you. End of dad joke of the day. Everybody ready? Let's go. All right. <clears throat> when my wife caught me standing on the bathroom scales, sucking in my stomach, she laughed. Ha! That's not going to help. I replied, sure it does. It's the only way I can see the numbers. <sighs> you know what? You know what? I'm still going to give it up. We're all going to give it up for you. That's good. You know what? You, you are a delight. Every day, it's a new dad joke. And I hope there's a dad joke every single day if it means you come back and give them to me. Thank you very much. I'm much appreciative of your dad jokes. DT Fish. Hello. Hello. How are you? It's not a long game post. Okay. That makes sense. Um, I do remember he was very cute. It like walking around with his little cape. His little, he's like very, he's very cute. I love him so much. I fly often. It's just so much. And a lot of people, you know. <laughs> yeah, people. <laughs> yeah, people. What what do you what do you get to do? Honestly, my um I had a huge fear of flying and, and kind of what I do now is I uh I wear sunglasses for one and then I wear headphones. Like I wear good headphones and I make sure that they are noticeable headphones. Um, if I have a hat, I will wear a hat. Like I, I will look as comfortable as possible and I will obstruct as much of my face as possible. And if I do that, people get out of my way because they think I'm, I'm in a bitchy mode. Um, and it works. It works. Like, 
I, I, I don't, I don't know why people are just, people are scared to deal with a bitch and, and that's, you know, whatever, whatever they got to do is fine. Uh... Tetris, if you're in here, I just got your message. And I am, uh, I don't have access to Queep's Steam, but I'm going to send him a message and, and see if he can see that name. Um, but I'm also going to tell you this in a message in case you are, are in here or you're not in here or whatever. I'm, I'm still writing it in both places. Uh, Ripley, Nicole is still doing her weird ass thing on the ball, which is fine. You know what? Everybody's got to make a living. Everybody's got to pay for their rats somehow. All right, let's send this to Queeblet. Uh, Petrus. Okay. So that is done. They need to make helmet phones. Don't well no, they have helmet radio. But but don't they have people that, that can pipe in on on the helmet? Like like with a with a with an iPhone, like with a headphone iPhone? Right? Am I mad has, has have movies and TV lied to me? Is that not a real thing? Because I think it's a real thing, right? By the way, Kat, it 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 was a lot of effort <laughs> to get your package mail today. I like it's totally fine. Um, the person who was helping, um, who was helping me, he had never mailed anything out of the country before, so he had to call a manager over and then another person over, and it was like they used it as a as a teaching tool. So that was kind of cool. Purchase an inscription with my winnings. I'm looking forward to playing all. Nice, very nice. I hope I hope it is amazing. Melfina, my darling, how are you? Are you like are, hold? Please hold. Please hold. Please hold. Melfina. I am now following you. I have no monies today. When I have monies, I will subscribe to you, Melfina. But no monies today. Yay, someone got taught something. <laughs> it was, uh... It, it took three times as long as it should have, but it's okay. Like... I'm totally fine. And they're like, we never mail anything out of the country. This is just new. Um, they were super sweet about it. And they all of them triple checked to make sure that everything was right on the label. So it is. You're good to go. I already said this to you in a message. Uh, but yeah, we're now we're just waiting. Uh, let's see. Wait, which lie did I miss? Asusa, please remind me. Is inscription the one that I keep missing? Inscription. Inky black card based odyssey. Ooh, I, just that word alone. I don't even know what it's about and I want to play it. Oh, it looks so cool. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, don't they? Or maybe not, maybe not directly, but like, I, I could, I could have swore that I know, like, like that I've, and I don't think it's just in movies or TV. I think I've actually like seen or heard someone talking about it in real life. Like there was an actual, like, you can pipe in, um, but like just even headphones at the very least. 
but I'm not a cyclist. I'm not a bicyclist. I'm not a motorcyclist. I don't wear helmets. I'm not sure a helmet would fit over this big old fucking head I got. Um, so I have no idea, but I thought I could have swore that this was like a real thing based in reality. Just don't check any spoiler things. It's mind blowing. It keeps changing. Oh, OK, that's good to know. Um, by the way, we're about to do uh, hints for the game of the day. I'm running a little late here. Um, but this is what happens when you have ADHD. And not real phones, but headphone phones. Ah, damn it. DT, yes. The object of it. And this is something like it just it. it it spontaneously happened after we started doing this thing. It's not like we started doing this thing because of it. Like, this is a whole thing. Um, both of you hear the hints. Like, he's in the hallway, like, getting ready. He hears what I say. Um, if you make guesses, if there's a guess that's so out there, I will say, like, no, that's not it. Um, but for the most part, I will be very neutral. Um, Queeb is at an advantage because he knows all from all of the games that I picked. Like, they're his games. So he knows. Um, yeah. I want chat to guess the game before Queeb does. And it, it's something that it, it spontaneously happened. Um, and it works. It works. It works. Um, let me pull up my tags. Here we, oh, that little bee. Oh, that is adorable. DT, well, I'm his friend on Steam now, so I have an advantage too. <laughs> good luck. Uh, super good luck. Let me. Oh, what the f just show me show it to me thank you all right is everyone ready for the hints remember if you get it dead on or even if you're just like wrong i i'm not gonna say whether or not you are unless it's completely out of left field and in which point i'll be like no it, that's not it um because i do want you to guess it but i don't want to be accused of cheating because that's awful um this game has been out for a few years. We are talking tons of very positive reviews on Steam. Uh, like, like dozens of thousands. So it's like, it's, it's very, very well regarded. Um, the thumbnail, I love it. it. It's beautiful. It's perfect. It's, it's, mwah. I love it. <laughs> Halo. <laughs> you know what? Just to fuck with him, I'm going to put No Man's Sky on this list that I've been compiling. <laughs> the people want to see you play it. <laughs> Um, every, every thumbnail of this, uh, of this game, it looks like a goddamn movie. It's beautiful. It's, it's brilliant. I love it. Um, I was very selfish when I picked this one because I, I want to see him play. Wasn't there this more colorful version when you do less of No Man's Sky? Wait, what? Clarify. Uh, the tags. Now, what I generally do is I'll do all the common tags first, and then I'll do, like, the weird ones. Uh, because for the most part, they all have the same stupid friggin' tags, like adventure, dark, action. Um, this one is not a roguelike 
or a rogue light. It is indie. It is a hack and slash fantasy action adventure. Realistic. It even has a blood tag. Which is kind of okay, whatever. Um, female protagonist. Story rich. Atmospheric. And now we're going to get into some some little wonky ones, okay? We've got dark fantasy, violent, uh, dark, so I, I don't know what the, the difference is, but there you go. Um, psychological, and mythology. Susan, no, but thank you for reminding me of that game. I don't think Queep has ever played that. If he has, I haven't been present when he has played it. Junko, hi! How are you? Yeah, so those are all... Well... Yeah, those are all the tags. Um, I'm stoked. I think he will like it. I think you will too. I am copying all of the... We, we actually have a lot of guesses for today. So that's cool. Um, so I'm just going to throw them into a, uh, a document. So... I'm not having to... What I normally do is I, I frantically scroll up. And I'm like, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. And it's just, it's a nightmare. So we're just going to copy them into a doc. Give me a second and I will look back at chat. I'm just making sure I grab all of these. Good guesses, by the way, all of them. The Great Jug. How are you? I haven't seen you in here in a while. We have not, but it is on my list, Gungeon. It absolutely is. We, we, it is, uh, and I will show you. I might not be able to do it. Hold on. What is that right there? Enter the country, motherfucker, yeah. It is on my list. Complete with the song. My game knowledge consists of Pokemon, Minecraft, and League of Legends. Has Queen ever played a Pokemon? I don't think so. I don't... We... Not on stream. He has played it, but not on stream. We're not exactly a uh a pokemon family i know if you need to unsub it's cool you can we are not a pokemon family we're not we're not been using queeb as a sleep stream to silence my oh that's amazing thank you jack is the game of the day Minecraft? Oh, that is a good one, too. That is a good one. I like Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. It's very cute and, like, not as grindy. Really? Really? I think the reason I haven't played it is because it's... Have you ever... Have you ever... Have you ever had a dream? No, have you ever have you ever talked to someone who is like they are down in the bowels in the pits of hell with Marvel comics 
and you cannot mention anything regarding Marvel or anything in, in in like in a particular realm without this person just immediately jumping in and they like know all of this knowledge. They're like, well, well, what about this? And did you read this one? I don't think you're not a real fan. And they literally just like 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 they act like they are like this this I don't know like this this font of knowledge, this oracle of knowledge of like everything that has to do with that one thing. That yes, but we're talking like gatekeepers to like the nth degree. Like it's overwhelming how much that they have focused onto something, right? <laughs> no, Fina. Um, and the few the few people IRL that I know are are openly into Pokemon. That's how they're that that is exactly what they do, and it has overwhelmed me and. I, I now I don't want to play Pokemon. Thank you. It, yes, minting is correct. It, it, absolute elitist. Like just there, there is literally like even even if you knew exactly what issue they were talking about, you like you you have the pages plastered on your walls. Even if you knew, they would find a way to just make them seem so much better and i know that it's not all pokemon fans i know it's not most i know it's not even half or like that but it's just so much it's been overwhelming pokemon let's go is the one that quote real pokemon fans don't count as real pokemon and i am putting it on my list for that reason thank you queeblet is that you it is me. Hello. We've Hello. had we've had uh, another request for for hints. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're about to do it. My seven year old cousin is a Pokemon elitist. She trashed on my favorite. You know what? That little seven year old. She ain't shit. <laughs> she ain't shit. All right. All right. Here we go. It is a beautiful game. Okay. Beautiful screenshots, beautiful thumbnail, beautiful game. Um, tens of thousands of positive reviews. It's been out for a few years. Here are the tags. Please note, as always, these are Steam tags. They're not entirely accurate. Some of them are a little wonky. Some don't fit. I have no control. I have no control. This is this is what I got. Okay. Um, in no particular order, but I am going to save the more niche ones for last. We've got atmospheric, story rich, female protagonist, single player, dark, adventure, action, action adventure, third person, indie, hack and slash, it says indie fantasy realistic okay now we have uh fantasy horror psychological and the number one tag that will absolutely give it away mythology So we've had a lot of guesses. I can give you the guesses we've had so far, if you would like to hear them, Quiblet. MM, I don't, I don't have Hellblade. Yeah, I don't, I don't have it. All right. Um, I'm making sure nobody else guessed anything else. Okay. So far, we have, uh, we've had a guess for Tomb Raider, and someone else said it does sound like the Tomb Raider reboot. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Titan Quest, Bloodstained, uh, both Asuza and DT Fish collabed on this one, Journey to the Savage Planet, Devil May Cry, Minecraft, <laughs> Remnant, and I'm not sure if he was joking or not when he said it, but I'm still going to give it to you, Halo. Uh, my T-Mans, my T-Mans. 
Uh, we also have several guesses for Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. Oh, and we just got one for Blades of Time, God of War, and Bayonetta. Look, he can identify however he wants to, okay? <laughs> Lollipop Chainsaw. Uh. <laughs> what? I I feel like at this point I need I need to to give a, another hint, a final hint. Are you ready? Going. You do not have it. Oh. But it has been previously requested and a while back, I don't know if you remember, you told me that I can pick any game and you will play it for me for my birthday, and I never picked a game, but I'm picking this game. This is my birthday. Um, you, okay, are we right? Is it, is it? I have a few people saying you are muted or mic off. No, it was, it's not now. Okay, go ahead and check. The curveball! Curve <laughs> Junko general pictures, you can do, uh, if it's not a, an animal picture or a meme, you can go ahead and throw it in general. Either on Cleebs or mine. Hellblade. Um, well, we, we got to go shopping. It just so happens oh, yeah. that the Steam sale was, starts today, too. <laughs> Post Logic, congratulations for, for your, uh, your guess. A few other people, Double M got it, of course, because of course Double M Fucking got Double it. Double M gets everything. Double M. I mentioned that I think we should rename that. It shouldn't be I am first and best. It should be double M is first and best. No, other <laughs> other people need a chance. Um, so I I was just about to go to my wish list actually and check out here. Is is there anything worth grabbing? Um, that's on sale. So far, I've added to the cart. Did you fucking clear my cart? No. Not you. Steam. How do I get back to my cart? My cart's gone. God damn it. Also, um, before I forget, oh, we have had Hellblade. we have had a few requests, a few more requests. Um, whenever people request a game that they want to see you play, um, I'll jot it down. Obviously, it's Salt and Sanctuary, Enter the Gungeon, Slime Rancher, The Last of Us, um, No Man's Sky. Fuck but you. <laughs> um, it's currently on sale. Uh, 75% off. Fuck yeah, let's get it. There we go. There's there's my... So I got... I, I haven't purchased this yet, but I got We Happy Few, which is like fucking... Um, 75... 90%. It's, it's real cheap. It's six bucks. City of Brass. I have no idea what that is, but it's 90% off. One Deck Dungeon. It's a dollar. Raz Razenroth. So that was that was uh, recommended recently for 50 cents. Hellblade now for $7.49. Source of Madness. Is it any good? Haven't played it. I might have booted it once, but I haven't played it yet. Too forgetful. I think if if I made a special request... I would like to think that he would play No Man's Sky for me one more time. I tell you what. However, I have made such a fucking stink about this goddamn game. I tell you it what. Wouldn't, it wouldn't fly. I will put No Man's Sky and Alien Isolation on the spreadsheet when it launches early next year. If you want it, if you want to see it, you're going to pay for it. Um, let's have a look. Oh, Wildermyth is 25% off. Still 20 bucks, but it's better than 25. I got Power of 10, 20% off. Mind Scanners, Dystopian Political Simulation, yeah, 35% off. Galactic Mining Corp. Hey, Kat, how bucks. different are the same prices on your end? 
Mind scanners is fun. All caps. That's fun. All right. Oh, that's another 10 bucks. What else we got? Fine. I'll allow it. Um, Devil Slayer Rek Rexasi. It's another one that's on my list. Mun Mundon. Mundown. It's 40% off. Hand-drawn, psychological horror, stylized horror, story-rich. And then Revita was the other one that I kind of wanted to get. It's 25% off at the moment. We're in uh, North America, Craig, on, on, on the West Coast. Alien Isolation's creepy. Yeah, I know. That's, that's why I'm not going to play it. it. It's one of those games where... It's kind of same tier as looking underneath the beanie. Like it's up there. It's beyond that. <laughs> um, all right. Did I add mind scanners in cart? What about Titan Souls? Do I have Titan Souls? Titan Souls I have. Oh, that's the one that was free on Epic a little a little bit ago, right? It's just boss fights after boss fights. And all of the boss fights seem very puzzle-based. They have like a weak spot and you've got to time it, right? And eh, it's not really my thing. It's up it's up there with that other popular adventure game that's out recently. Would I say Alien Isolation's McCreepy? I wouldn't. No. No, I think that sounds ridiculous. Is it just single player horror that isn't jam or horror in general? Horror movies, I fucking adore. However, when it comes to Alien specifically, I I can't. I can't do it. I I am terrified. Ah, there's the other one I wanted to buy. Hard Hard Space Shipbreaker. It's on my list, currently 33% off. And then West of Dead as well. What about I'm just gonna fucking Mun down. I got it. I think I, I think okay. I got it. Let me double check. Ziggurat 2 is 10% off. Might wait. 10%. You got you got to do better. You got to you got to wake up on the other side of the bed to get one over old Queeb. Did I get Mun Mundor? Is it how do you pronounce it? Mun Mundown. Mundown. Yes, I know, I know how it's written, Azusa. How, 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 how do you say it? Uh, Little Nightmares 2 is currently 33% off. Eh, I can wait. Uh, West of Dead. We'll get that. Azusa with that damn B. I'm helpful. <laughs> what do I think about what? Prey? Love it. Love it. Prey's one of my favorite games. Donkey Jim, how are you? Uh, we had a lovely solstice. Uh, same, same as every other day, because we didn't exactly specifically celebrate it. But... Yeah, we didn't do shit. I watched oh. The Matrix this morning. That was fucking cool. I liked it a lot. Okay. I liked it. Well, I haven't seen it. HBO, log in. Get, you get it for free. You know what? I'm just, instead of not seeing shit because I'm thinking we're gonna watch it together, I'm just gonna watch shit. Uh, just gonna watch we just shit. got a one hundred dollar Steam gift card live what? on stream from really? Suey Run. <gasps> you cheap, oh, cheeky shit. motherfucker. Suey, you know what? Thank you. Uh. I, I might just name name a snake after you, Suey. I might just do it. I mean, Archie needs a middle name. Okay, so I got We Happy Few. Suey, was there a specific game that you had in mind that you wanted to see? Not that I'm going to guarantee it I'll play it, but we can fucking we'll pick it up. Absolutely. Suey, like, Suey's the best. Thank you, Suey. The Final That's Station awesome. was another one. That's a survival game. Something I'm not really keen on, but it's 75% off. It's in my cart. It's got to be there for a reason. 
We're at 96.43. So, Jesus. That's that's insane, dude. Thank you so much. It adds up. Oh, Christ, no, you do. You are a delight. Thank you very much, my dear. All right, my dear. <laughs> Thank you. We will have fun. The Last Stand Aftermath. Survival rogue light top-down shooter with zombies. I'm, I'm sorry. Hold on. Monkey just said there is a dolphin writing photo in Discord. Excuse me? Where? Where? It's in pet pictures. Technically a pet. Uh, you know what? Dolphins are mean assholes, but I, I will. I like this. I, I approve of this. I love this. Have I played Thank Gunfire you. Reborn? Yes, I have. Yep. All right. Well, let's get one more to round out the hundo. Um... Ancient Abyss, you, you guys tell me, Ancient Abyss, Troubleshooter, One Step from Eden, Walson Lords of Mayhem, that's a, that's a fucking Diablo like, don't, don't worry about that one, Greedfall, Open World, Single Player Choices Matter, RPG, I, I, I did, I did like that, I did want that, really, I did, I also wanted the Unpacking game, Unpacking's another one, What's the what's the city building one? It's five bucks at the moment. It's from Raw Fury. It's really relaxing. It's it's not really a game. It's you build a city. All right, we'll get this Greedfall Gold Edition. Is it Townscape? Maybe. Or Townscapers. I think so. Yeah, something like that. Yep. Adventurous Gear DLC. Fucking add it all. Let's go. It's going to ask me if I want to download everything. I'll be like, well, slow down just a bit. Donkey Gem says, what about they always run? Oh, I got, oh. Give, I got given that. That's I got that from the dev. That could be a bonus game. That looks really good. It looks like flashback. Yep, 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 yep. Adventurer's Gear DLC? Fuck yeah, add it. Love it. Uh, what were we just talking about? Townscaper. Yep, it is currently $4.80. Yeah, that's the one. This is So this one, you can actually export your creations to a 3D printer file. And um, you can print whatever you make. And I think you can do it in, in segments, in parts. And I was just about to say what non-major nerd just said. You can use it to build like tabletop towns. How fucking cool is that? Uh, what was the other one? Unpacking. Anything else? Anything else? Unpacking still 20 bucks. Brick of Clay, thank you so much for buying a sub for Non-Major Nerd. How totally fucking cool are you? Thank you. I will take care of that in just a bit. Give me one sec. What a legend. You absolute legend. Mm-hmm. And I've been thank saying you. that long time before that fucking speedrunner dude, Carl Jobst. Carl. Yeah. Carl. Alright, I'm gonna should I buy unpacking at full price or wait? How much is that? Twenty bucks. You can wait. I'm not gonna play it like in the next week or two, so just it's it's cool. If you'd like to Carl Fucking Walking Dead. Alright. So, in my list, we've got Townscaper Greedfall Gold Edition plus the Adventures DLC, uh, Final Station, Hard Space Shipbreaker, West of Dead, w Wilder Myth, Revita, Mundown, Mind Scanners, Hellblade, which will be tonight's game of the day. I've got to update the, the, the thing. 
Razenroth, One Deck Dungeon, City of Brass, and We Happy Few for six bucks. That was probably the biggest savings there. 121.21. Hey, that works. Since today is uh, 12.22.21, apparently the last time in all of our lifetimes we'll have a palindromic, if you're an American, date. Well, that's depressing. All right, cool. I agree. Purchase. Suey, again, thank you so, so much. Let's give that gifted sub. Who was it for? Non major nerd. Consider it done. <clears throat> Also, the uh, Amazon, about the Amazon gift card winner from last night, mm -hmm. I have already messaged him. Right on. And PostLogic just said, I think I got a mod message about approving a new roguelike game for the roguelike subreddit. But since I marked it as red, I can't for the life of me remember what it was. It looked amazing. Don't you hate it when that happens? That happens a lot. Yeah. Like, no, no, no. It's fine. I'll remember. You won't. <laughs> narrator he in fact did not remember okay one oh. gift sub incoming that's done let me Let's check that off my says, list it's free on game pass what game are you talking about asusa if you want you can get three months game pass for one buck and get unpacking and townscaper both i think oh that's cool cat says we happy few on steam in russia for two dollars and seventy cents Wow. <laughs> In Russia, discounts help you. Oh, that would be so nice if discounts actually helped us. All right, I think I think I'm gonna stop looking at this the sale because I do this shit all the fucking time. All right, got to download. Uh, what's it called? Hellblade VR edition. Oh wow, we get that for free. Um, can you give me a roundabout time as to when you think you will start to play that? Because I would actually like to watch uh, the first bit of it. Isaac could probably go for three-ish hours, I would say. If that works, then I'll, uh, I'll go, uh, do house stuff because I am a housewife, um, and take care of your son. And then I will come in here around 10. No problem. If you could actually Perfect. pause your open I am stream, going that would to be pause great. It. I'm actually going to sleep my computer. Um, I might come in here and do some actual work, work, but uh, but yeah, I will. Uh, I will be back in here in a bit. Thank you guys for being so super cool. I hope you enjoy, um, Isaac. And oh, uh, if, if I forget, I hope you enjoy Hellblade because it is my birthday present. Even though my birthday was how many days ago? Two weeks ago, my birthday was two weeks ago, but it's okay. This I have birth birthday all month. That's what we do here. Uh, housewife doing housewife things. It it completely accurate, Malfina. All right, I will. Uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. WebP is not supported. Well, how about you fucking disable at WebP for everything? How does that sound? Why don't you just delete the technology? I don't care how efficient it is. It fucking sucks. I said what I said. Thank you for the birthday wishes. I appreciate Miss Creep thanks you for the birthday wishes. Oh, just give me a give me a thumbnail. I need a thumbnail. It's all good. This soundtrack is fucking rocking, so I'm happy with that. Save image as. Can't I just choose a different type? Oh, I hate, I hate it, I hate it.
Is this Risk of Rain 1 or 2? The sound, that the music that we're listening to right now. Either way, I dig it. I think they're equally as good, right? Like, it was known for its soundtrack way back when. The, the original. There we go. PNG. That works. Boom. Updated. Alright, let's switch on over to Isaac. Image magic in the command line. You're, you're a command line jockey? No, not, not me. Not anymore. All right. Nice. You subbed to Hyper's channel today? He was beyond stoked. That is not a misplaced sub, my dude. Very good guy. Isaac, run number 26. We are... Almost halfway there. Bought five games for 65 bucks. What'd you get? Yeah, if, if you got any any good games, just let's talk about it. I love I love Steam sales. I'm I don't I can't afford Steam sales, but I still love them. He accidentally timed you out for five seconds. I mean that's a to be frank, that's you you, you get what you buy, right? Someone gifted you inscription? Oh, dope, Crow. I'm really excited. Um, once you... I'm not going to say an absolute word. I want you to experience that for yourself. But once you've beaten it, um, come back and do the do the roguelike version. Hopefully by then it'll, it'll be like out of beta. Huh, a little bit concerning. Lack of damage, but Harlequin Baby should make that a little bit better. These fuckers hit me. Okay, we can't pick up red health. That is a great sign. Perfect. means we at least have one and a half soul hearts left. Found our ultra secret. Dope. Well, just walked straight into that one, didn't you, idiot? Yes, we will take that. Hypercoagulation. Oh, rough boys coming up. Ah, shoot. Typing for a free solely there. 
can I scare you over this way and then down a little bit? That's it. Nope, nope, other way. Oh, you're doing so well. Keep, yep, just, excuse me, sir. Shit. Okay. Rude. What does it do? Every time we take damage, we drop a half a heart somewhere. It, it scatters. You have to be real quick to pick them up. But, uh, yeah. It's a, it's a great item, actually. It usually lets you take advantage of things like blood donation machines. Um, still can't pick that up. That's either a very good or a very bad sign now. <laughs> we could be down to one solely. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> One solely. What did I say? <laughs> womp womp. Oh man, we didn't even get to do the predictions. Still 10 minutes remaining. Damn it. Delete and refund. Sorry, folks. Troll bomb. Fancy that. Fancy that. Thanks, Eddie. Hey, you know what? Just means we have to try harder. Yeah, obviously we have to lock in the votes before we before we tally them up. Did I do another one? I gotta do another one. Oh, no, I did. I did. I started another one. Red key run, too. Yeah. So a little bit of a, a pang of fear did run through me when I couldn't pick up that... Um, the red heart. I'm thinking... Because your minimum start is one red or two, two solis. We had two solis because I got hit twice prior to that. I knew it. I knew it. Could have one red and one soul. Oh yeah. Yep. But that's the minimum that you can have. Is um is one red or or, or two soulies. Game seems to love throwing that fucking curveball at you. So even with one red, a, a, a troll bomb, a homing troll bomb will kill you. Hey, what do they say? Something about sh shit happening? Damn, I cannot catch a break here. Start again. Is 15 minutes too long to vote, maybe? Well, it wouldn't have made a difference there. 
Game is angry, very angry today. Yo, let's go. Now chat, what did we learn from yesterday? Oh, the struggle yesterday. Now I'm even sadder because fuck me, I fought for that. <laughs> Count the soul hearts on the floor? I ain't even fooling with it today. No. Soul hearts go straight to me. I gotta get this number back up to not only what it was literally five minutes ago, but um, we're still chasing 57. I will probably end up taking this. I mean, there's two. Uh, I can't afford it anyway. It's fine. Uh, it's not a. It's not a bad active item. The twelve room charge makes it a little bit less desirable, though. So I think I'm gonna go for. Um, could keep the key too. Be nice if I had a Bible in here. Yeah, okay. Big boss helper? It is. Well, it depends. It depends. Because it's Delirium, it can be any boss that spawns. Um, some of them are a lot more useful than others. Did I just see a bug? Yeah. What the fuck? It's leftovers from, um... Leftovers from the, from the guy. Gemini. Anyone else find it weird that they call Gemini Gemini? And not even... I think it's only when re referring to the space shuttle or the space mission. Yeah, it's staying with me. It's coming along. All right. I don't know what's causing it. I hope it's not um, one of the mods I'm using. Doesn't seem to be helpful at least, so that's good. No, it doesn't seem to be Melfina. Good 
shot. Oh, look at me. I'm fireproof. Yo. Great trinket. Alright, cool. Is this? this is a confessional booth. You spend hearts and you can remove broken hearts and you can also um what else get what else can you do in here? Uh get solis. You can you can yeah you can do a few different things. Does it ever pay out? With the supplemental stuff, yes. With an item, very, very, very rarely. Fuck it. Nothing to lose. I wonder if it's luck based because uh, I don't seem to be having any. Uh, there you go, we've got an eternal heart. Well, that's something. Our quibbles? Hey, you, you bet the way you want to bet. Save the key. Yeah. Yeah, okay. All right. Miss Queen put pop rocks in today's. Uh... It's weird because the shapes are all like different sizes. Sometimes I get a few more. Another library. Interesting. Managed to walk past that. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, watch the Matrix this morning. I liked it a lot. I thought they did a, a really good job on re rebooting, I guess, the franchise. Bible. Book of Belize. I'll stick with this. Good way to regenerate health. Oh, hi, Zoe. How you doing today? You having a good day? Yeah, I bet you are. Obviously eating something. I think we need a uh, farting dog emote. Two lucky coins. Yo, ah, oh, that's a shame. I mean, I'm, you know, the item's good. Uh, the item I will, I will take. I'm out of keys. Means no store. Could go curse room. Might be a good payout. Actually, I can also activate this guy. Bloop. Nice, 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 nice. Aha! All right, we are we out of here. What was the item in the item room? Oh, the yuck heart. Is yuck heart on my do not take? I don't know. How do you define a do not take list? Like, would I pick it up under normal circumstances? No. However, it might come in handy. What do we got? Couple of days till Christmas, huh? Pretty dope. 
Christmas Day, don't forget. Noita will be the game of the day. What is Crimbo? Is that a specific thing or just another name for Christmas for people that don't necessarily want to use the term Christmas? <laughs> Noita sounds nostalgic. I mean, I haven't played it in a long time. It's going to be an adventure, that's for sure. An informal British term for Christmas. Okay, so just like a, a slang word. All right, no, no problem. Uh, yeah, so if you have HBO, by the way, check out Matrix. It's free or it's included in, in that package until like January something um, like I said I liked it uh, I've seen a couple of people including man versus games say it was bad um, yeah well what can I say that's that's one of those things that's very divisive I guess I liked it I liked it very much I thought they did a great job Sounds fun. That it does. That it does. It's like, uh, it's whimsical. It's Crimbo. Get with the program, you Crimbo hater. Oh, yeah. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I'm so far behind on my um, VOD channel. Like, I'm, I'm three months behind in publishing. So they're all uploaded. I've got, I've got three months. I've got up to last night. But obviously, I can't publish that until 24 hours after stream. But I'm thinking maybe I'll publish two a day. Like, one when I do it, which is directly after stream. So, like, five, five to seven o'clock in the morning, whatever. And then one, like, middle of the day kind of thing I just want to catch back up because it's it's bugging me that so many videos are unlisted or private or drafts whatever whatever the difference is there uh, this is looking to be a very strong build luck is the thing that we want to stack most of Okay, that's fair. That's that's re that's reasonable and and measured. Yep. Mm -hmm. No. So on that channel, I got I got three channels. Um, one of them, my primary channel, has about forty four thousand subscribers. I think uh, it's like my edited content. Although lately, over the last year and a half, most of that edited content was highlights from from clips, highlights from streams, and 
I had an editor for a while when I had a job. We we had to part ways. Um, so it's barely being used. I uploaded a few shorts to that and I'm like, I got a mixed res response to the shorts because mainly that was the same content that I was making for TikTok. Different platform, different audience. Um, so that was kind of fun to figure out. And then I had... Um, second channel which was my VOD channel and the VOD channel is literally just that um, straight uploads now occasionally so for example the uh, uploads on YouTube have limits you're allowed either 30 gigabytes or 12 hours if it goes over 12 hours even by a second um, the video will get you can't publish it. You can't do anything with it. Um, so sometimes I'll have to go back to Twitch, sort of slightly knock them down a bit, and then uh, attempt to republish again. Um, but mostly, mostly it's full VODs. For the subathon, I cut that down into game specific, right? So I, I painstakingly went through every single game we played during the subathon cut out little bits and then downloaded them using a bulk downloader and then re-uploaded them. I could have published them straight to YouTube from Twitch, but I would prefer to see that process myself. Um, yeah, it is full, it is full VODs on the, on the VOD channel. And then I've started a third channel, which is going to be just clips and short form content. So like your shorts or, or TikTok style content just for that. I haven't really done much with that yet, but I've started it at the very least. Twitch type content doesn't do well at all. Twitch talk type content doesn't do well at all. Yeah, um, but if it's... Um, so good. I don't know. That's that's one thing I've gotten away from as well is is the the Twitch advice and stuff. I still don't mind talking about industry stuff, like you know some of the mistakes Twitch make or current controversies and my two cents on that or or whatever, which I'm sh that there's no lack of, no shortage of. Uh, but generally speaking, it's just it's just me talking to a camera. I've gotten a lot more confident because of TikTok. Um, what used to take me thirty attempts to record, now I'll do a one and done. It's it's good enough. It's, uh, I'm a I used to be a perfectionist, and as a result, nothing would get done. Nothing would get published. Now I'm like whatever, just fucking get it up. And I'm a lot more, like, comfortable talking to the camera one-on-one. -on -one. That's one of my biggest fears, or at least was one of my biggest fears. I'm really happy about that, too. Yeah, I've, I've shifted my content a couple of times. You can... It's actually funny to scroll back to my earlier stuff and see how I started and, and compare it to what it is now. I don't even... I bought myself a handheld stabilizer thing um i don't even use that anymore i'm I, I just hold the phone in front of me and record straight up it's convenient it just works it's like a, it's like a bethesda game it's that good started doing dnd stuff with trends on a separate TikTok. First time you've ever dressed up for a character. That's the that's the wonderful thing about TikTok. People don't realize how powerful it can be. And I get it. I get the stigma. I get the history. I get the audience. But there's good and bad on there. Um, but it requires someone to actually look past that for a moment. And, and to see it.
Like I've met some of the greatest people ever. I found McLaffy Taffy through there, as as hard as that is to believe. Um, I'm I'm gonna say this, and please don't repeat it to him. Highlight of my fucking year meeting that guy. Yeah. It's uh, I'm 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 super stoked to have met him. <laughs> Quiet storm, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, and funnily enough, I learned a little bit about Isaac as well. I It never occurred to me that you could die from a starting run, but of course you could. Um, his mom's toenail clip was the one that I saw, and... I've told this story before, but I've heard the name many, many times, and... Uh, but, but you never check check out a streamer that you hear their name of like you, you might right but the, the likelihood's pretty low because there's just there's too many people to check out um yet here we are what's letting me see inside items that would be guppy's eye it's a new item in uh in repentance extremely powerful it lets you see inside chests and lets you see inside fires and shopkeepers and what else i think that's about it skulls no not skulls skulls and poops you still have to shoot i think Same as rocks, you can't see in insert rocks. Whoa, okay, that was lucky. What do we got? Fuck you. All right, let me see if I can figure that out. What do I need for that? teleport item hangman won't get us there will it no no you need the teleport you need mr me um there's not many items that will get that for you pluto really Kentai, I'm doing good, man. How you doing? Oh, shit. Kentai, that's the third library we've had this run. I didn't check out that clip you sent me last night. I just started the Matrix straight up. I, I did nothing else except that last night. Getting a few dupes here. Last day of work for the holidays. Right on. Oh, that Lamegaton and... Really? That doesn't do anything? Hmm, okay. Well. Fair. Ah, oh, wrong book. Oh, I won't keep it. What did we even get? Spider face. Cut off her nose to spider's face. A 
Oh, that's it? That's it. Well, you know what? Let's see if we can actually get... Stitches or Mr. Me. Oh, car battery though. Fuck you. Never mind. Too good not to take. Devil Delio, let's have a look. That's interesting. That's the same book again. What the hell? It's my dog getting in trouble. Do we need the damage? I think we'll be fine. Megaton, actually. Oh, yeah. Great opportunity to reload that dono machine. Back over 400. Nice. There you have a secret room that breaks breaks some rules. really good Easiest get ever. The hanged man. Hell of a run. Good run. Very good run. That's a lucky, lucky penny right there. Let's go donate the rest. Yeah, I'm excited to play Hellblade. 
It's, uh, it's one that people have been wanting to see for a long, long, long time, and I never got around to it. Because I didn't own it. When we bought it, we put it on Miss, Miss Queeb's Steam account. She's the one that wanted to play it. Um, and I, I didn't have access to her shared library. It was, it was only the other way around. First or second one? Wait, there, it's Senua's Sacrifice, whatever that is. There is a sequel that's been announced, right? Or is there two games? Oh, 30 cents? Shit. Second one's coming out. Right, okay, so yeah, I don't have access to that. We need 30 cents. Trinket smelter. This smells pretty good. Well, that's a tenth of the way there. Well, it's over half of the way there. realized this was depths two I could have been farming uh battery charges this whole time that's fine do you take rotten hearts as well you do What's the little holy hand grade grenade thing do that we've got? That's uh, guaranteed better items, right? Might explain this run a little bit better. Right, it is, yeah. Strength card, okay. On anti-birth, it used to just kill you if you had a rotten heart and no soul hearts. What, the... Dagger thing? Really? <laughs> Interesting choice. Luck is at 6.4. Naturally, that's pretty exciting. dead end. Wow. Holy Hand Grenade is a Monty Python reference, yes. But Worms co-opted it back in the 90s.
Fucking worms, man. The, the number of hours that I put into that game. The follow-up, the un the unofficial sequel to uh, Scorched Earth. Hey, Kamai. Worms also was Team 17. What was the game that I played from them? I played a few. The turn-based roguelike dungeon crawler one. Little cartoon graphics. Very cute. Female protagonist. Some good trinkies, man. Well, one good trinky. All right. I just wanted to see what Krampus had. Uh, thing Easter. You know, the thing, the thing is. Zero. Yeah, that's what happens after uh, after you get hit. The counter gets reset after you die. Shit happens, bro. It's all part of the fun. Going under? No, 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 that wasn't it. it. Was uh, crown, crown trick. That's the one I'm thinking of. It's quite good. I haven't played that in ages either. It's probably had some updates since. Hopefully, some content updates. I think I finished that a few times. I don't think there was much else I could do in that. Maybe just weapon unlocks and stuff. Same as Returnal. I played some great games on stream, that much is a fact. Somebody asked me earlier and I didn't answer. I, I saw it, but I missed uh, I missed miss remembering that. How was Cultist Simulator later last night? Interesting game. I don't hate it. Let me preface that, because fuck me, there's some passionate viewers. Um, it's not for me. What happened? I started the health with um, Curse of the Curse of the Unknown. Um, I took two hits and I tried to pick up a red heart. Didn't do anything, so I knew immediately uh, it was either good, aka I still had a red heart or two, or really bad, and I had one solely, and that was indeed the case. And then a troll bomb fucked me. Yeah, it was one of the one of the massive troll bombs that, that does double damage. The, the 
the homing ones. Shit, if it was standing still, be still be still be on that run, still be on the streak. Bad luck. Still need flight to get that. I think you could maybe do an epic hack shot or some kind of remote bomb like uh, Epic Fetus would get us there for sure. Actually, otherwise, it was a pretty good run. Uh, I mean, stats weren't baller, but all right. There has to be a place to bomb to make that work. To make what work? What the fuck just happened there? Why? The room with the rocks over a gap? Yeah, I think... Well, the problem is that it's on the corner, right? So you would have to be precise. It would have to hit, get hit from the left side or, or the right, depending on which rock we look, we're talking about. The accuracy you would need. The wisp? Oh, no shit. Okay. That's kind of cool. Random chance at unlocking a red room. thought it was another bug or a bug related to the fact that we keep seeing uh delirium gemini on the screen the chance increases got it you're watching me well duh of course you are my broadcaster on twitch Does it when you enter a room too? That's pretty dope. Conjoined. Is 
Sorry, wanted to be a creep for the moment. You don't know where I live, and my windows are blacked out, so... Maybe pick somebody else. In fact, no. Don't pick anyone else. Don't do that. Chili Pepper Central. Let's go. This this build's gotten ridiculous all of a sudden. Or progressively ridiculous over the last couple of floors. Shit, a single red key is freaking dope, dude. Like, that's wild. So either I took damage or... Because we've lost the red key. Either I took damage or it expires. Probably probably took... Uh, it it may maybe, maybe take good damage. That damage though. Fuck me. That's awesome. Put it up. Hell yeah, one streak. Let's go. Next run. Another prediction? I'm trying to get through these quick because Miss Queeb actually wants to get um get in a little bit of time with Senua's sacrifice this evening. Streak ended? No, no, no. Streak, streak is up to one. What are you, what are you talking about? No one is betting no on this one. I don't know, man. The wisp. Uh, the uh, what's it called? Breath of life. It's not amazing. PJ certainly helps us a good start, though. Uh, I'm saying that damage and damage is low. Speed is low. Mm 
can get another key maybe. So used to red being yes. Who would put red? Never mind. I see the emote. Does he just have to do everything the opposite of, of what normal people would do? Or is. Yeah, probably. Later, Quiet Storm. Thank you so much for stopping by. Realistically, though, chances are you're better off voting no in the first couple of runs because my care level has dropped from 100 to 5. the iframes last it probably doesn't change i wouldn't be surprised if that was one that doesn't get modified by the fact it's golden that that is an area of the game that kind of still needs improving i think like come up with a solution for items that i oh, sorry trinkets that are golden to be improved instead of just oh no it does nothing different and I'd say probably 20% of them do nothing different. Tough boss. Well, I mean, it's not, but my damage is so low that it can be. Watch me. Fortunately, my tears are just on this side of shit. Jesus Juice is a uh, B tier item. But it's damage. It ain't a lot, but it's it's mine. Golden no rerolls zero quality items. Really? That's interesting. See, that's what I'm talking about. But that is so rare that golden trinkets actually do something that's not written on the can, right? I walk into it, idiot. How far will that get us in this room over here? 
not far enough. One. Two, maybe three. Yep, knew that about kids drawing. So the problem with it being gold is that not that it's improved, right? It's that it has twice the effect. That's where the problem lies. If they just reworded that, they could do whatever the fuck they wanted with some of the unique ones. Nice. Pretty decent item. I can get into the curse. Well, I can get into the curse room anyway. Dice House Fliegen. Dud, you got... Dud, dud you goat... The most useless spacebar item. I agree. Why do you think I haven't used it? does have its uses by the way it's not completely useless but i would say d tier oh not you anybody but you fuck Edmund loves Curse of the Tower. Curse of the Tower has its uses. Most of us won't see that, but yeah, you can have a Curse of the Tower built. I mean, Pyro Curse of the Tower is, is essentially it, but still. Don't do that.
Fuck. Fuck. Judgment. Yeah, I thought that's might what you might do. Wow, it does last forever and I can't My frames suck. <laughs> Loaf is being a menace. Yep, he's he's getting he's heading to the kennel as we speak. Imagine if Curse of the Tower was a level curse. <laughs> that would fuck so many people. <laughs> I didn't just say that. Ed, scrub it, scrub it from your memory banks. It didn't, it did not just get said. That's a that's a tough choice. Um ah. Only because I want to play this out. Ah. 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 <laughs> All right, Queep. We will take it with Think you have a terrible memory? What about? The damage would have been nice, but uh, I too like to live dangerously. Oh, they changed this. No, this is a different setup altogether. We can actually get all of these. Uh-oh. Be decent. I wouldn't mind that card either. We fought a bonus boss before. Gross. Uh, I did get hit like three times in that last one.
Has anyone else watched The Matrix yet? Just me? stuff would I like? Cat food or dog food? I don't think it matters. Steady. Steady. On a scale of 1 to 10, how good? Uh, I liked it out of 10. Man vs. Game didn't like it, if that means anything to you. Uh, somebody else on Twitter said it was meh. Did I say man? Yeah. Yeah, that's exactly what I said. Weird. How is Keanu's acting? Amazing. It's Keanu Reeves. Consummate professional, I believe is the term. Hard for me not to see John Wick when you see him with long hair. That's fair. Yep. Yep. The outfits he wears um, don't help matters any. The question is, how many meat mans can we get? Murder Hobo, what's up, dude? Good to see you. Tonight's game, if you haven't already checked. Uh, Senua's Sacrifice. Um, Hellblade. Does Hangman do? Yeah. Final thoughts on Cultus Simulator? Weird. Um, I had someone come in and they said they were really sad that I didn't enjoy Cultus Simulator. There must have been some kind of miscommunication because I never said I disliked it at all. It's not for me, but uh, but no, it's it's clever, it's clever and it's weird, and there's a fuckload to learn, uh, but it's not for me.
There's speaking of wrapping Christmas presents. There's a, uh, a woman on TikTok. That's her channel essentially is is wrapping presents and my god, the skill level shown is just fucking wild. Ooh. It's like it's like art. Yeah, it's pretty fucking impressive. Clear rune soul of Lilith. That's for you, Dan. That's for you. I'm actually blown away by clear rune soul of Lilith. The price doesn't go up. It's a four room charge. Fucking wild. I might be mistaken. Two days away? What's... What endings? It's only... So obviously Dead God, which is collecting items. Um, and it's all tainted lost, but what, what endings does he need to do? Is it Christmas that he's going for or New Year? Addicted. Hmm. Kinda want that. Beast Mother. Sacred Orb and Death Certificate. That's it? Ah oh, shit. Yeah, he'll he'll do that. No sweat. No problem, Jim. Take it easy. I could go down to... Hmm, no, I can't really. 
Well, yeah, it could. Why do I why do I think that's a good idea? I don't. No, that's not worth. However, that is interesting. Go. Fuck off. Well, Isaac, you brought this upon yourself. gonna work. I don't want to lose my black heart if I can avoid it. Oh, I should have done it early. Not grabbing the flight. Oh no, I am. I am. Not yet, though. I, I had bigger plans. stupid but whatever um and instead of actually fighting this room now let's do this instead stars gotta find my way back there card back oh go down to the basement nope oh yeah there we go Where's my fucking sun card? Down and right. Huh. Thank you. Ugh. And then once we reach the next floor, we'll do. A, we'll activate twice. Give us and give us flight and another another meat man's.
That's how you can tell it's early in a streak. Okay. Why is my... Yes, I know it's a spear. Why is my sword gold? What is causing that? The milk, you reckon? Hmm. Okay. Imagine if Meat Man's blocks tears as well, which rightfully they probably should. You gonna run a side hustle on how many meat men's we end up with? We may be looking at the max number here. Maybe. Kind of an appropriate item, I would say. SMB super fan. Hmm. 
We might make it to number three. It's risky. Especially with rooms like this. BFF. Don't know if we can get it now. Oh, it's still one more shot, maybe. Okay, good. What's the green aura? Dead tooth. Hey, Corey, what's going on? Night is going very well. Tonight's uh, game of the day is Hellblade. Yeah, for trying to save a machine that I didn't actually even need. Okay. Come back to that. Can't come back to that. Uh, I will take another, I'll take a teleport card to get that, that's worth. I'm out. Shit. chance at likelihood I'm going to keep it though. Not high. There's one. Oh my god. Oh my god. The Hierophant. Ah, 
I've just finished the new Matrix and I'm here to soothe the pain of that experience. So apparently one Rubble Bob does not share my enthusiasm for the movie. Go get that card. Loved it. Thought it was great. Uh, we're not going to talk about anything at all story related or spoilerific here, though. No, nah, I'm not going to be responsible for the, that on my conscience. No way. We get a complete one here. Um. All right. Well. Let's just go. Level three, meat man's. Oh, so close to having three. Too invested in your own nostalgia? I saw The Matrix nine times in the cinema. Nine times. Um, Two of probably my all-time, uh, next to Heat, one of my all-time favorite movies. Um, I mean, I share that, that enthusiasm for the original. I thought this was great. I thought they were real clever about it. I thought the writing was, um, was quite good, the way they showed everything yeah it was it was good i enjoyed it i had a great time the original was so good yeah yeah it was now Red Martys? We're calling him Marty now? Okay, Dan. I used to I used to actually dislike the sequels, the, um, the episodes two and three, Revolutions and Reloaded. Um, but I my opinion on them has changed over the years as well. I look at entertainment as a 
as a form of entertainment, I guess. I don't look much, much more beyond that. Can I fucking forget my life for a couple of hours? Yes. Good movie. How could you dislike sci-fi? Sorry, no, I can't I can't get off that. Like there's wrong and then there's that. clear here jesus ah, i did leave a solely behind used to dislike reload and revolutions everyone's like oh the the architect is so boring that monologue he gives is fucking cool doesn't make sense but it's spoken like a robot. And if you remove all the extraneous words, makes sense. Got to revisit this stream in the morning and ask why he didn't. Did you tell him about it? I don't expect him to, by the way. That would be... Oh, that would... No, that... He... he he's... He's a proud man. Uh, that would be... That would... That would be giving in. He doesn't want to accept it. I did hear him say the other day, you know what? Redemption arc was the term he used. What redemption arc? Sci-Fly started at a 12 and it's gone down to an 11, right? There is no redemption arc. If there's a redemption arc, it's going to go back up to a 12 or higher. I need it. I need it. Okay, here we go. Someone talking smack. Yeah, Dan Geesling. Big brother fucking 20 whatever winner. I know. He's a smart guy. Maybe, maybe they're right. Maybe Dr. Will was the best contestant. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't want to admit it, but with the sci-fi comment, I mean... Fuck.
So you think you think he's he's damned himself. I think that's the problem, huh? He has embraced the meme to such a degree that the meme is reality. Maybe maybe memes are like the matrix for Dan. We gotta we gotta free him. gonna get our, th our third Marty. My bet was on two. I was wrong. Fucking hell. Gotta go for four? <laughs> A bit rough. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. This is, yes, this is how we got on the subject of Dan. Why am I getting invincibility? It seems to be from kills, but I don't have uh, the pouch or whatever it is. Right. Huh. I like it. I like it a lot. Do we need to have zero red hearts for that? Seems to be every kill too. Every 40 seconds spent in the same room since last activating when the timer displays 0, 20, or 40 seconds a shield triggers. Oh, it's not on kills. Huh. I just gave up a Meat Boy for Toxic Avenger. 
Uh, why? Is Toxic Avenger his name? Oh, I didn't have any reds. Mm -mm. Can I use bonies? We'll soon find out, huh? Nah. Well, maybe it's if it's full. We'll test. Nah. All right. Yes, I would happily forgo another meat man for uh, Rotten Baby, though. Temperance. Oh, come on. Wait just a minute. Did I have... Yeah, okay. Any red hearts deactivates vessel. Including... Including bonies. Alright. Alright, that's fair. gonna be all right folks if you voted one now is the time let's see if we're walking now we're walking now no shit i hate it I hate that little guy too he makes cute noises though
Shame no BFF, huh? Whoa! Three Martys. That's it. Pretty good, though. Okay. Two runs for the day. Unfortunately, those two did not get added to previous. Hey, what you gonna do? Alright, we're gonna do a quick BRB here. new items in my inventory what best soundtrack trade oh trading cards from right okay from the steam so i was like what the hell now what are we playing hellblade i have to get i have to get miss queeb on board here she wants to she wants to join in She's the one that selected this one. It's it's her birthday wish that I played this. Hello, Ordinary. How you doing? Actually, let me run a quick ad while we're doing this. I'm going to go grab another drink as well. I suggest you do the same. Binaural sound. Interesting. Okay. Accessibility white. In-game subtitles. Subtitle size. Let's go large on that, I guess. I'll keep it standard for now. Menu background, half transparent, mono sound, off, color blindness. Okay. Graphics. Very high. On, ray tracing, fucking high. AMD FSR. Oh, I don't have an AMD graphics card. CPU, yes. DLSS, sure. Quality, balanced, quality. Direct X12, fucking crank it. I'm sure it'll be fine. Folks, give me a sec. I'm a, I'm a BRB. Looks like we'll be ready to go real soon. Looks pretty. I wonder if that's... It's in motion. Could be a filter. I don't know. Alright, give me a sec.
All right, I am back. Thanks for waiting. So since Ms. Queeb requested this, she's outside with Zoe. I'm gonna, just going to hang here for a couple of minutes. Talk to me about uh, Steam games you, you bought. Anything decent? I did see a little bit of the game preview video that they showed at the game trailers for this the sequel um very impressive oh i had to double check that i sent that gift card i'm sure i did um a recipient message miss queeb saying they didn't receive it or, or something like that to double check Yeah, yeah, sent. You got Noita three weeks ago? Is it yogurt? No, it is a... Uh, it is a, um, a protein. I think it's really good. It's like a meal replacement kind of thing. Um, so addicted. Also, how you found me. Oh, right on. Style, that's, uh, that's dope. That's dope. Good to have you here. Speaking of Noita, we'll be playing Noita Christmas Day. That's a that's a special reward for for everyone being so nice to Miss Queeb. Uh, I picked two games on this event, and everything else has been chosen by Miss Queeb. So I'm talking about you. Oh, there's a curtsy. Proud proud of most of them. I I think you did a great job. I didn't ask people what their opinions were but we do have a recommendation channel where people can yeah no people don't post enough in there I post shit everywhere else except there um are you jumping on chat or are you just gonna watch If it's a well, if it's a narrative, yeah, I guess it maybe. Nope. Crises. Thank you so much for the raid. Hello. How you doing today? How was your stream? What what did you get up to this evening? Hello everybody. I can't hear you. God damn it, motherfucker. You're muted on Discord. What about now? Yes, now I can hear you. Oh, oh, okay. So what I was saying was what I will probably do is I will stay connected, but I will stay muted um, unless I am asked a question or whatnot. And uh, I'm, I'm just going to sit back and enjoy because uh, I don't know. Uh, there are some people in chat who know this, some don't. I've tried to play this game. Um, I bought this game. I was very stoked to play this game because I learned about how they uh, researched to set it up, right? And uh, I was really stoked. I tried to play it and I could not. Part of it was a failure of a, a decent uh, controller. Mm -hmm. And the other part was that I, I'm a bit of a scaredy cat player sometimes. So if I think something is going to jump out and scare me, I will 
make the window as small as possible, but still playable. Um, and it helps. And I can't, I couldn't do that with this game on my monitors at the time. Um, so I've never gone back. And I've wanted to, so um, I'm, I, one, I wanted to see you play a game that I liked, but two, I'm going to be watching you play so I know how to play when I play it. Got it. Understood. Hellblade's an amazing game. We love Hellblade. Finally hit the climax of Disco Elysium right on. Uh, I don't know about these controls. I'll leave them as default for now, but I may come in and switch them around a little bit. Should I turn on... I'm going to turn on fucking spoiler warning, warnings, I think. Let's do that, hey? Would appreciate that. First playthrough. I'll, I'll let you... clip anyone that gets out of line. Yeah. Is it Chrysius? 0529? Crisis. 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 Um, is, uh, we're TikTok friends, right? That's where we met? I think so. You, you and the TikTok. What uh, can I say? <laughs> the mental health professionals lived experiences shared to help create it as well as the historian. I was on the fence about this game until I, I looked through, uh, I looked through and I, I found out that they had, um, they had worked with mental health professionals to make sure that we all feel extremely uncomfortable while playing this game. Mm. Um, and as soon as I read that, like they didn't, it, it's not the fact that they made it so you would be kind of fucked up while playing it. They made it so so you would know that th this is an experience that people have. So it was uh, pretty cool. All right, we're ready. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm gonna mute. Oh, the audio. Let me tell you about Senna. Okay, so that's not just me. So her story has already come to an end, but now it begins anew. What's her It's breathing. It's breathing. It's breathing. Oh yeah, I don't like that. It's quite unnerving, huh? There will be no more stories after this one. Why is she doing this? They're watching. Why didn't she die? She's doing this for him. He's always been in the end. Oh, how rude of me. I never told you of the others. You hear them too, right? They've been around ever since the tragedy. That's not quite true. Some are old. Some are new. But they've changed. I think the darkness changed them just like it changed her. Can you see them? quiet right now or do I just not have any sound from this game you promised. Yes. it's quiet it's whispering okay I don't even hear the whispers God damn it.
Can you see them? Can you see them? They're going to do that to you. Dripping with atmosphere. What is she thinking? I can tell you. She's afraid. Wouldn't you be? You'd think she would get used to it by now after so many years. But the darkness. It just builds onto itself, growing stronger. You might try and ignore it. Turn away. But it's always there, just out of sight. Where you're most vulnerable. It's like it knows that just enough light is all you need to see its suffocating power. You might think she's brave to go on this journey on her own. But it isn't bravery that drives her. Bravery only means something to those afraid of death. Said it was fear. Runs far. This is ninja theory? Not surprising. Even the camera movements, very subtle, but it builds tension. There's no going back. You can't do something. Somehow pushes away a world that conspired to cause so much suffering. There's nothing to go back to and worse to look forward to. Why don't you join us? Maybe you too have a part to play in this story. story Senua because your darkness comes from hell and your fate lies there they say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to Hella's gate but gods and the living will follow this path you must leave the Isles of Orkney across the Eastern Sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep dark valleys after nine nights of riding, you will follow a great river and will find a bridge covered in gold. The path to Helheim goes from there, across the river of knives that flows from the dark world of Niflheim. Focus. Look closer. Look. Use your eyes. Why is she looking closer? Do not forget my 
my story, Senua. Because your darkness comes from hell, and your fate lies there. They say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to Hela's gate. But gods and the living will follow this path. You must leave the Isles of Orkney across the Eastern Sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep, dark valleys. After nine nights of riding, you will follow a great river and will find a bridge covered in gold. The path to Helheim goes from there, across the river of knives that flows from the dark world of Niflheim. Pretty fucking gorgeous too. said the river of knives across which lies the halls of hell the place they call hellheim There's no doubt about it. The source of the darkness is in Helheim. And the goddess Hela holds his soul.
She's not here to see. She'll never make it to her party. <laughs> she can't even get to New York to hear our fate. Do you know where the you are? Bridge to Helheim. I forget its name. She forgets too. But she does remember that. Dry sees no sweat. You have a great night. We're, we're witnessing some stutters here. It's very loud in my ears, so I'm not sure why it's not coming across through Twitch. adjust it slightly. I have to turn it down on my end though. But it's yeah, it's very loud on my end. And I should be hearing what, what you're hearing. Sky gods dwell in Asgard. The gods of Earth, Harvest, Wind, and Sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones dwell in Svartalfheim. The mountain giants dwell in Jotunheim. The fire giants dwell in Muspelsheim. Niflheim is the world of ice and darkness. Only the dead dwell in Helheim. And that is where you must travel. I play video games. I wonder if the dialogue's going over more than just left and right channels. No options for that. I'd rather not do that. Um, no, nope. I mean, Twitch is stereo. It does have binaural audio, it did say that. Where you are? 
Where are we? So brave. <laughs> Why did she do that? She shouldn't have done it. Not so can't go Stop. back now. <laughs> no, this is it. The hidden path. Kill me. I'm not one of them. Don't listen. I was just hiding. I find I live longer that way. Don't listen. I never let the bastards catch me again. Never! Wait. Who are you? It's just a memory. Drew? of the Northmen. They call me Druth. A liar. He's lost. An old fool. <laughs> Druth is my truth. Huh? It's good to see you again. You kept your vow. I guide you in this life and the next. I will tell you my stories of hell. Tell me your stories again, old friend. I'm listening. The runes seal the gates to hell. Focus your inner eye. And you too will see what's hidden in plain sight. Look, I can see one. Hold it in your mind's Focus. eye. Focus. Find one like it to open the gate. Do I have to match it or literally find one, I wonder? Sorry. I'll find one. Very uneasy feeling. It's Much have you missed? Not much. Not much. The gate is open. Go through the gate. Go through it. It's dangerous. Like ten minutes. What's behind the gate? Where will it take you? It's not safe. It worked. I spent six years enslaved in hell. But I watched the Northmen. Learned their ways. I know you did. You listen? When everyone else laughed, my people paid a heavy price. Carry my stories with you, and together we will make the Northmen feel our fury. Another voice joins us. She once tried to make them go away. Pretend they weren't real. What is that? When we are always here. I guess it's the same with heights. You can stand on the edge. Pretend it's going to be okay. But you know that death is near, waiting for you to make that little slip. You can't just wish things away. Don't 
Don't fall. Don't fall. Don't fall. Mmm. The world of the dead is ruled by the giantess, Hela, daughter of Loki. The gods feared her bloodline, bad on her mother's side and yet much worse on her father's. So, as a child, the Allfather cast her down into Helheim and gave her power over those who die of sickness, age, hardship and self-slaughter. In all of the nine worlds, only Hela can resurrect the dead. To Hela, your Dillion was sacrificed, and with her you must bargain. So it looks like we have a certain number of these rune stones to find in each section. We found three so far. Got an achievement called The Fight Begins. Stay back. Look at it. You have to open it. The gate to Helheim divides the living from the dead. Is that the face of Hela herself? The half rotten goddess that walks over Helheim. Whatever horrors lie behind that door, she must find it. We're going to bump this down ever so slightly more. Oops. Turn that off. And actually turn DLSS off as well, I think. Yeah. That might be what's doing it. And I'm going to change the controls. Oopsie days. Um. 
Oh, that's not too bad, actually. That's not too bad. Okay. Great acting. Love it. A vision of what's to come. Poor Senua. The darkness does not bargain. It does not reason. It is rot. And now it has taken hold. It will spread towards her head. The seed of the soul. Until there is nothing left of her. All of her suffering will have been for nothing. It's just a matter of time. Leave that fight. If a rot, if the rot reaches Senua's head, her quest is over. I believe that fight could only end one way. I couldn't fight back against the shades, but we shall see. The hardest battles are fought in the mind. That is what Dillian taught her. With every defeat, the dark rot will grow and soon it will take her soul. But for now, at least, she still has control of her mind. And she will fulfill her vow. Whatever the cost. She has to fight two gods first. Two gods? Two, two gates. gates. Which will she choose first? One of them will kill her, I know. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to die. The Northmen say that in the beginning there was nothing but darkness. Bitter cold to the north, fiery hot to the south. They say the cold formed ice, which melted from the sparks from the south. The power of the darkness gave life to the dripping ice, and the first giant was born and was named Emir. The ice continued to drip and the power of the void 
gave life to it, and it became a cow whose milk fed the giant. That's right, a cow, but you weren't expecting that. Ancestor of the seers and master of ravens. He hunts his prey with his powers of illusion and feasts on their remains. Follow the path to Valravan and defeat him in battle to earn his mark. The gate to Helheim cannot be opened without it. I see what Ms. Queeb was talking about. It's zoomed in very close to the character, even more so than God of War. That's that's probably intentional as well. It makes you feel somewhat as though your vision is obscured. A little bit claustrophobic. Grandsons were dark after him. Of his daughters and granddaughters, some were monstrous, but others were fair. But there was another who came from the ice. Buri. In shape, he was like a man, big and powerful. His son, Bor, took a fair giant to be his wife. And they had three sons. Odin was the eldest, and the Northmen hold him to be the foremost of the gods. The old father. Probably going to be tweaking this for a little while. Did I miss the cool chant? So that's the kind of comment that just tells me that something is coming. Let's not discuss it at all, huh? From the trail. I don't give a fuck where it's from. Don't talk about it. hides the path to Valraven. Don't trust your eyes. Find another way to see the truth.
It's much more deliberately paced than God of War as well. God of War, I mean, I'd be sprinting by now. It's more of a, this is more of a light jog. Voices are mocking me. They're like, oh, you can't see it. Okay. It's funny. We all want to see behind the veil, don't we? But once we do, we mostly just close our eyes again and pretend what we saw was never really there. Yeah, that's got to go. I think because my graphics card is currently doing a lot of work on rendering video. It's just a little bit, a little bit stuttery here and then. It's probably a, a resolution issue as well. Very unnerving. I, it's it's I like it, it's weird. Yeah. What was the other game Ninja Theory did? Female protagonist, red hair. I never played it. But I heard nothing but good things.
she will find what she's looking for. And then what other what other game did they do? Horizon? No, 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 they didn't. They didn't do Horizon. Heavenly Sword. There you go. At the time, like renowned for how good it was, like graphically, especially. But what 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 else did they do? Ninja Theory. For some devil may cry. Really? Was it just one specific one? All right, we need to get up high. They did enslaved, huh? Hey, cheeky fucker, come down here. No, I don't want to. Do I like it up here. Align the I got it. She's a lover, not a climber. Stand back against the door, maybe. Unless that has something to do with it. Hmm. Have a look. Oh, yeah. Dude thinks they're so good. Journey to the West. Andy Circus. Oh, nice. Oh, right. That's the. Is that out, or is that still coming out? That that was announced some time ago, right? It's got to be back here. Kind of like it, like how it, other than, you know, align the ravens, it's not giving me any hints what, whatsoever. Pretty dope. What's that thing to my right? Oh, that's how we get up high. Uh, please, no hints, by the way. It's an old game from 2010. Didn't they announce a new Journey to the West? That's a bit better. Like, from, from only a couple of years ago.
passing into another world that looks the same but feels different. An imposter world where the forest itself is watching. Okay, so we've got to activate the door, align the ravens again, which probably means we have to get up high-ish. Possibly. Another game. Another game. <laughs> you know what to do. Stay back. You have to open. It's not safe. Don't listen to them. To break the seal. Black Myth Wukong. Only a couple of years ago, maybe in the last year. Like recently, they announced a new game, but it was it was like years away, I think. And it it had some new graphics technology. Maybe I'm misremembering that. I don't know. I got it. Yeah, I've got to do it from the other side. Chinese Souls like where your main character was monkey with Yep. Yep, that's the one. It had a demo. Mm -hmm. Comes out in 2023. There you go. That's the Journey to the West game that I was thinking of. I'm gonna follow the groaning this time. Bad for a six month subscribed, you absolute legend. Thank you so much. Great to have you back, dude. Oh, there we go. Challenge me. Oh, he disappeared. Where is he? Find your fault. Keep pointing at door. So these are like vision gates. Stuff changes when you go through them, possibly. We'll work that out in time. We ain't going that way. Oh, Raven has gone back over there. Under the bridge. Over the bridge. Later, loot. Thanks for stopping by, dude. You take it easy. Is she lost? I love how it, it immediately you start searching around the game goes, Is she lost? She journeyed it's all your fault. You lost him again. You're stupid. I'll forever changed. I'm also not strong enough to open doors, so... What else? What else you got? Oh, 
it's a very it's a very good way of telling like i know it's somewhat condescending but it works in that they're talking to the character not to the player it's 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 clever it's a very simple way to show that you're either on the right path or you're completely not ah okay It's better than having a radio buddy. Hey cousin, wanna go bowling? It's it's well done and I think from what I've I don't know don't know much about this game at all. Um I know that Miss Queeb wanted to play it and that she's been super excited about that forever. Uh, we couldn't really get it up and running because we didn't have a controller in at that at that moment um and uh and the the point of view wasn't it was a new the first time she was playing a, a third person very close over the shoulder game and it was it was very off-putting for her and it's creepy as hell that might have been another thing Before I go anywhere, one moment. I don't know why I didn't get into this. Like, I, it's critically acclaimed. Um, a lot of people have said that it's an amazing experience. It it handles mental health really, really well, which we're advocates for in this household. I can get up now. Something changed. Look at that. The stairs. Okay. Do I like it so far? Very much so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's cool. Audio is... Like, it, it's gorgeous, but audio is, is probably the biggest thing here. Very, very powerful. I do have it cranked right up, too. So if I sound like I'm shouting, I don't mean it. He's feisty? That, that means he wants to say hello to chat. Come here. Bring, bring me my... Bring me my son. got any rats that's that's mama she's got the rats he is so I might, fired up I'm, yeah I'm not gonna do an egg. okay you've got three more right just grab my hard drive whenever Actually murdered. He doesn't weigh as much. He hasn't eaten he's, a, he's a little bit thinner he hasn't he hasn't eaten in two weeks maybe that's why he's so hungry you want to say hello to chat
Aren't y'all excited because it's Rat Fan? Are we gonna name one Shade? We 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 can name one Shade. I'll eat it. I'm very hungry, but I'm not gonna eat it today. Mom doesn't know if uh if I'm actually gonna eat because I might just psych her out like I have been. Yes, murder hobo. Thank you. That's my command. I did it myself. What are the... What's the oldest one? I already did his. I already did that one. I already did that one. Trabuco. Shade. Dad. Dad, I'm very... His eyes. He is just eyeballing me. If you look very carefully at him, he's nodding. He's doing the nod. I inadvertently trained him how to nod when he's hungry. It's a very slight, like, it's a little more than a tremor, but like he does it when you're looking at him like, yeah, yeah, you're going to feed me because I would, uh, whenever I would walk past him, he would stare at me. <laughs> so I would nod and I'd be like, yes, yes, I'm going to feed you. I'm getting your shit. Dad, your neck looks uh, very radish. I'll, 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 I'll take a, take a nice little squeeze, Dad. Do you mind? Dad, do you like my winter colors, Dad? I don't think they're going anywhere. I think this is just me now. I don't know why I ha I give him that voice. Like, whenever, uh. My best friend and I, we send each other videos of our snakes talking. And his voice is always like he is a an 18th or 19th century Victorian child who has died from polio. Like he's a ghost. And he's always just like, Mommy, Mommy, can I please have a, have a rat or two? I have room. I can do it. Dad. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, he's perfect. He's so perfect. I waited too long to get a snake. I should have gotten one when I was 20. Yeah. Yes, because then I wouldn't have him. Well, maybe I would have, but I don't think so. And he's perfect. Dad. <laughs> he's wonderful. He's a good baby. Dad. Game sounds at extra <laughs> Are there any rats? Do you have the rat? Quick, over there, I saw the rat. Do you see the rat? I see the rat. Do you see the rat? <laughs> I mean this in the kind of way pot. It, it's a mix of butters and towelie. Anybody got a towel? Oh, oh, oh. No, baby. Oh, it is rat vent. Ms. Queep made a new command. She's like, I love the sound of rat vent. I don't know why she sounds like that now. <laughs> because I keep rats under the beanie? No secrets. All right, we need to find this dude. Uh, where was the thing that had stairs on it? I lost that. What is she doing? You'll notice that, that it's flat up here, right? Like, the headband keeps it in place. Unless I have a huge chunk of head cut out. Oh, that's a possibility. We, I'm, we're, or the rat is part of me. Like, uh, Total Recall or, or Harry Potter. A 
A rat cockpit under the beanie. Okay, okay. It's a men in back, men, men in black situation. So this is a. McQueeb is just generally shit at geography situation. And nothing more. There it is. We do greed mode with Eve? <laughs> Dodge. Um, utilize poor Babylon. Get that off the ground as quickly as possible. So, soul hearts and some way to get rid of reds. Um, high damage, extra health. It, 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 nothing much changes. Eve's, Eve's a very straightforward character. You can even treat it as a normal character. You don't even need to worry about Horror Babylon. It'll just give you an edge, that's all. It doesn't mean that it's not already here. Let me guess, do I have to fight something in here? I'm gonna fuck you up. He's a little bit stronger. So this has adaptive, um, an adaptive difficulty level, which is interesting. Two. All right. Audio cue is very important. They're telling you when to dodge and evade, so. Pretty good. Stop backseating. Oh, Miss Queeb, if that's if that's the worst I had to put up with in this channel, I wouldn't be grumpy all the time. Negative 20 win. Um, maybe try unlocking more items. Like go for go for different unlocks instead of just focusing on the one character. If if you hit a brick wall in Isaac, just just switch it up. Try something else for a while. You'll get better at the game. Um, and then come back come back later. Greed's Greed's fucking hard. Wait till you get to Greedier is, is like, yeah, Greed is, Greed is a walk in the park compared to some of the stuff you'll face later, but 
it's all about it's all about dodging. I heard that it is against Twitch terms of service to have individual letters as emotes because people can write inappropriate things. That makes sense, but like stuff like don't backseat, you can't really can't really fuck that up, right? She can't go in there. You were thinking about my progress with the binding of Isaac tonight? Chad, high emote. What the fuck is that? I've never seen that before. Zeke. Oh. Okay, I follow Zeke. High emote. It's so fucking simple. I love it. <laughs> so Maggie's not bad. Um, low damage, high health. I would go with Kane if you haven't already done Kane. That's that's my pick for a start. Medium health, high damage, luck foot to begin, so pills are on the on the table. Um Yeah. It's my my favorite character. Am I backtracking? Shit, I don't know. Looks like it, huh? I just ended the fight and then went out this... Yeah, okay, yeah, I think I am. Well, we can't open the door. I don't really have a choice here. Try again. No, look, check it. There's runes on the other side of the door. So that's a way... What is she doing? She's a fucking idiot. Turn around. Stop getting lost, you fool. Have you tried not being shit? Yeah, Kane's Kane's dope. I don't think he starts with um with Lockfoot, so you might want to find out what the unlock for Lockfoot is. Or more to the point how to get Kane to start with it. Back in the day, they had emotes like that. Yeah, no doubt. No doubt. That was a post... Post-incident change. No doubt. I do like, here's here's one observation straight away. There's a lot going on here landscape-wise, right? There's like fallen beams. There's, looks like there's little gaps and caves and trees and shit in the way. And you're like, well, yes, I could theoretically fit under there. But it's very obvious where you can go and where you can't. Other than doors. Um, what it's like to leave everything behind. They've done a good job with that. Your home. Loved ones. Deep into the wilds. Perhaps never to return. Did I just skip the collectible Seven pillar? Dust. Fuck's sake. Was it a darkness speaks? It changes everything. Yep, I definitely did. Turning home into a foreign land and loved ones into strangers. Exile makes sense when you realize that you were never really home in the first place. Is it auto save? Can I revert to a different? This is what I'm talking about. Yeah, I'd, I'd I'd rather not even know that and go. Oh shit! I forget. I forgot something later. Now all I can think about is how the fuck do I get back there? I'm gonna spend 20 minutes looking for a way back there.
because my my own neuroses as a gamer are gonna take over here. Oh, so, Hobo, it, that wasn't necessarily a bad thing, right? Like, I was heading the wrong way. But I would have also figured that out in about 30 seconds as well. It's, it's all good. It's, it's fine. There's not too many of them. You can do this. Well, that's a lot, I guess. The song. Bell Raven. Bell Raven's song. It's over here. It's over here. Shtal, I haven't played Path of Exile, no. There's two. No, never, never played it. The fact it's free to play is probably what turned me off of it. Well, that and every single person I spoke to was like, wow, I hope you're prepared for a 200 hour tutorial. And I'm like, well, that makes me feel like I want to play a game. She wanted to fight her own darkness. She thought she could beat her own darkness. Actually, if there's runes on that door, we can potentially go back there. That might be the door we were looking at before. So I'm not worried too much. The complexity is the most put off putting thing. Well, that's a, probably a good thing that I listen to people then. There's there's too many games to get bogged down in it. I wanted to get into Eve back in the day. And um and I did not. There we go. She thought she'd bring the darkness to Because of the tutorial. The tutorial was like 2 3 hours long. Not from this side. The vision blurring is quite um, weird as well. Ah, uh -huh. okay. It makes it seem very overwhelming. A lot of visual noise, but it's simple when you think about it. Yeah, now who's laughing? Voices in my head. You got 1600 hours in PoE? And everyone who likes Diablo... 
but wishes it was more complex should try it. I'm I think I'm over ARPGs. I uh think I've moved on. And that the world of man was formed from his corpse. Well, according to this, I haven't missed any he yet. His bones into stone, and his flesh into earth, and his blood into the salt sea. They set his skull to be the bowl of the sky, with his brains for clouds. Odin and his brothers caught the sparks flying from Muspel, and made them into stars. And to protect the new world from the giants, they used Emir's great curving eyebrows as walls. Well, oh, Sultan Sanctuary I've finished uh, a couple of times, I think. When you start and stop the jog, she moves like her left leg is injured. Doesn't look like it. It's not blood on the outfit, at least. There is a sort of a, 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 a hitch there, as though she's, uh, yeah, like there's something. What was the top-down retro graphics adventure game we were playing the other day? Hello, Zealousy. Top-down retro graphics? Was it on, was it on the Queevent calendar? Top-down retro graphics. Oh, uh, Unsighted? You mean pixel art, right? Unsighted was very good. There was also Dead Estate, which was pixel art. I didn't particularly like that. Many people did. Wow, that is a lot. Nothing aligns from here at the very least. Yeah, check the um check the Queebent link right there, yeah. These are the same ones. We're going to need like three. Maybe there's only one to a line. We just have to find the right spot for it. Okay. Should you get Sunless C? I liked it. It's a lot of reading. Um... It's it's more of a narrative adventure with the minor sprinkles of combat mixed in. Where you're a cyborg. Yes. Yep, that is unsighted. Yep, there we go. So we haven't been up there to the other gateway. Shit, there's several. My god, this is a little bit more complex than I first thought. Okay.
yeah, a lot of bloom and, and glare and chromatic aberration and all sorts of visual effects going on here as well. Like that is pretty wild, right? Oh, we can reduce some. Okay. Okay. The ravens. They're gone. They're gone. No. Half of them have gone. They're gone. Some are still there. But where? Some are still there. No, no. Ravens helping. He's not helping. It's trick. Quiet. Is that intentional or a bug? I'd say it's intentional. Out in the wild. In the cold winter woods. Where have they gone? Yep. She no longer felt fit for this world. This game is... is it, it plays on your senses, especially audio, but uh, a lot of visual stuff going on, and I think that's it's entirely intentional. There's a reason we're so close to the character as well. She resolved to fight on and kill that which had become part of him. Where have we not been? I think that one up there still. Okay. get to it yet. Wait. Nope, that ain't it. Can I jump down? Can't jump down! wonder if this one has a dual purpose. It's got to be that opening. Has to be. Maybe. I don't know. Let's have a look. That's the way down, not up. Um, I think all of the above. Yeah, it's to induce... It's to induce stress. The Northmen say that Odin and his brothers killed Ymir, and that the world of man was formed from his corpse. They made his bones into stone, and his flesh into earth, 
and his blood into the salt sea. They set his skull to be the bowl of the sky, with his brains for clouds. Odin and his brothers caught the sparks flying from Muspel and made them into stars. And to protect the new world from the giants, they used Ymir's great curving eyebrows as walls. If we're close, I need to get up there. Up there. I can't climb this, can I? No. going up again. Alright, so I need to backtrack to another gate to see if it creates this bridge. I'm guessing it's that one possibly, but if no, if we close off that, that locks off this and I can't get up in the first place. Different one. It's the only way up here. Double check here, but I'm pretty sure that's not it. Oh! I take it back. Is that the one we opened the door in then? Yeah, okay. The whole wall was gone. I thought it was just a hole in the wall. Three, that's all I need, baby. Looking back, I was so naive to think she could banish it on her own. The further she saw into the darkness, let's drop down here. The more she struggled to see anything at all. And the glow, the smallest hints of shape, sound, or thought, grew in strength until they consumed her whole. Before she knew it, the darkness had her in its claws. Hobo, don't thank me, thank Miss Queeb. I didn't even own the game until tonight. She's the one that, that she, she broke the rules. She put a game on the list that I didn't own. To be fair, it was her birthday request. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> So close, so close. Just jump. So close. I'm 
unless you want to align from a different spot. Just, just jump. Think like a gamer, senor. Oh, I'm too stressed out right now. Okay, fine. You're a December baby too? Miss Queeb knows your plight. Oh wait, there we go. Yeah, yeah, so so close. Come on. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, right. Focus. Yes, focus. The gate is open. Open. Yay! There is no such thing as victory when it comes to the darkness. It's like it doesn't want to kill them. Yet. Twenty-eight. Oh, no. Wow. Anyone closer? That's tough. That's between, yeah, What's Christmas, New Year's. Will she find Dillian before her time comes? Sister's son was born on Christmas morning. He was treated like a king because of it. Also, it works both ways. The closer you get without... Wow. This room looks like an arena. Got another one. I like that that animation. The sidestep. That's cool. One thing I will do actually is Oh, the cursor's on been on the screen this whole time. Unacceptable. Run toggle on. Wait, did I? I inverted. Oh my god. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. Now I don't have to worry about running anymore. There's four to a line here. Okay. She could easily hoist herself up here. Easily. He's very strong. Okay, it's either either one of those rings or both. Other one first. I've told this story before. I used to work for Idos. And, uh, 
the game was Commando Strike Force, and we were we were QAing it. I think it was. I think that was it. And um, we had a build. So I was I was an inverted gamer, right? For my entire life, I don't know why. Probably from years of playing Tie Fighter. And we got a build that didn't have the invert functionality uh, turned on just yet. Um, so I had to, I had to play non-inverted, and it broke my brain. What does that change? Nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, activated anyway. Speak to me, Drew. Tell me a story. I want the truth. Listen. The Northman captured Finland's sister, and his father sent him to pay for her release. But they took his gold, put him in chains, and held What did I do at QA? Food or water. Um, at Idos, I was I don't know why. standard QA, Upon bottom of the ladder type deal. Manual functionality his testing. Um, but his brother was killed. At Sega, his I was standard compliance. His father's enemies offered redress for his loss and invited him to a feast that was at a hall near the sea. But when he went there, they betrayed him to the Northmen who enslaved him and took him to hell. Six years later, his slave masters landed on the shores of Orkney, burning all before them. And into that fire, Findon made his escape. What was Findon? burnt away that day but from the flames a new man stepped forward and drew just just born. jump up the rocks are wet i don't like and it I am now. and though Findon never set eyes on his dear sister the again, tree the tree okay I, maybe maybe Druth, i've found you Sinua. I wish you could have seen my home before these dark times. Oh, there you go. No, this com this combat, this combat puzzles.
Took a break from greed mode and beat mom's heart with Azazel. There you go. Azazel's another decent character. Um, the, the flying makes such a huge difference. Mm, don't have to go back over there. Back across. No, we need to get high. Up here. But there's more tree in the way. I'm guessing that's the way. Let's double check here. If we reactivate that. Does the tree change at all? No, not from that side. Uh, hold up. Back over the other side and reactivate that again? I don't know. It's one of those back and forth puzzles. We definitely have to get up here though. Yeah, that's the way. Back up the ladder. Check the tree one more time. Oh, that gets rid of the fucking branch altogether. I wonder if there is an option for all that extra shit post-processing. Shadows textures. Nope. Doesn't mean not. What about accessibility, maybe? No. Nope. Nope. It's just a thing. I have a feeling that branch has to stay. Concerned about the flashes. It makes it hard to see uh, where I'm supposed to be heading at the puzzles.
Wait, what the fuck is that then? Maybe over there is the thing. <laughs> okay. Back across the tree now? Tree's got to stay, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, no, no, I'm not, I'm not, the visual weirdness is fine. I was just hoping to reduce it ever so slightly. Because it's difficult to see landmarks and my goal. Hobo, yeah, if you, if you have an answer, sure. Lower post processing. I mean, it's not going to look as good, but. That tree branch right there, maybe, maybe, back it up. bird's nest which makes sense Uh, you're being pecked at right now, I would believe. Look into it. 
for it is a window into the underworld. Within, you will see the face of the darkness that you fear. And if you focus, like I have taught you to, you will also see that as much as the darkness has you trapped within its veil, it too is trapped within yours. Focus. 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 I see you. I see you now. You led me to the wilds. You trapped me there. She is pissed. Motherfucking bullet time.
Ow. There's not a too many, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Fills up my meter for when the dude comes back. Three. Okay, okay. They got visual representation of how much they're damaged as well, which is kind of cool. She's not going to die. Ah, don't dodge back, not forwards. Victory, bringing her closer to defeat. Unfair, isn't it? In those dark winter nights in the wilds, there were times when she considered letting go. If it weren't for truth, a chance encounter in the wilds, she would not have heard his stories of the Northmen. She would not have this chance to find Dillian's soul. I'm coming. I still hear you. Yeah, we have a corruption of sorts, which is on our arm at the moment. And every time you die, it spreads. And if it spreads to your head, that's bad. Have I died yet? Only once, but that was during 
I don't think it was avoidable, to be fair. That was introducing that, uh, that threat. The looming threat. When she was younger, she would lay in the grass and stare at the clouds. And then she saw them. Elusive. Shifting faces. Is it game over if you get to your head? The mountains. I think so. Caves. sees her face from time to time, hidden in the world. Like she's still watching over. She misses her so much. Ymir was a frost giant, a being of darkness, and all his sons and grandsons were dark after him. Of his daughters and granddaughters, some were monstrous. Oh, you don't need to stay. That's cool. But there was another who came from the ice. Buri. In shape, he was like a man, big and powerful. His son, Bor, took a fair giant to be his wife, and they had three sons. Moves like they do. Good. Oh. 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 
You know why it hasn't opened. I know why it hasn't opened. Are the bad guys saying Senua? I don't think it's the bad guys. We're the name is being called, but by the voices in our heads. Yeah. What's up, Crow? Great to see you, dude. Sort, the fire giant has answered. He comes from a land older than mankind. And the Northmen call upon his flaming sword to raise their enemies to the ground. Find him, Senua. And spill his blood. She found the wretched old fool on her way back from the wilds. An outcast. Was badly burnt all over. Him, doing good dude doing world. real good this is um this is this one is i had to buy this queen broke the rules the and she selected a game that i did not own speaking of ms queen i was saying you broke it broke the rules for, oh, no. for birthmas no 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 i did not break a rule i did not break a rule see i was told that my reward and i'm using quotey fingers my reward for participating in this shenaniganery that is the quibent quib miss quibentine's day quibs giving spectacular thing was that for my birthday i would get to select a game and he would play it and at the time i couldn't think of a game so i didn't take that right but i took it now bitch so that's why he's playing this. The so Others I didn't break a rule. I'm not a cheater. I'm not a thief. It's the not a tumor. Yes. Is it's the, the best day. The very the best game. Absolutely. Do you like it so far, Quibling? Yeah. You're good. I'm sorry, I don't. <laughs> oh yeah, no, that's not a path you want to go down, Crow. <laughs> Um, so it seems that I've missed three. Uh, three in the last zone. We may have to backtrack later. I don't even know if it, if it gives us anything except completionism and lore, but... Oh, hi, Zoe. How are you doing? Fancy seeing you here. It's so weird. You just happened to show up at this this moment, huh? Hmm. So weird. Quibentine's Day. I love it. Don't you worry. I got I got bullet time, baby.
This guy's in the background going, what did I fucking do? Does damage seem to deal? It does seem to be the case, yeah. Yep. Seem, seem to heal. I can still smell it. <laughs> A sweet, sickly stench of burning human flesh. <laughs> hot. Too hot. It's very hot. Unless I missed a route yes. back there, it's a possibility as well. And I still hear them now. Yeah, so much for turning off post 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 processing. This is still wild. Ah, right. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I remember. It's just like, uh, what's that puzzle game? From what's his name? Jonathan Blow. Other side. Focus. It's just like the witness. I was really impressed. I wouldn't play that. It's too puzzle heavy. Too too obscure puzzle heavy, let me just say, but the environmental stuff where you had to sort of use those as the puzzle pieces that was pretty dope when they first came to my lands i knew enough of their tongue to beg for mercy and they took me as a slave i wish now that they had slaughtered me like the others I rode their storm of fire, death, slavery to many lands. This darkness you speak of? <laughs> I know it well. And I'm still here to fight it. Not exactly fair.
Get up. Jeez Louise, this is not easy. Yeah, I don't have a head a VR headset. That'd be quite good, I think. Slow and steady. That is my only move at the moment, Zealousy. Oh, Crow, I had my first uh, win on... Into the Breach last night. Using the second, uh, the second team, or the second, what do you call them? Squad. played FTL in a while. I'm really waiting for an update to um, Multiverse. When you see a fire gate of Surt, know that only a sacrifice will stoke the fires of Muspel and let the dead walk through. Find the fire, Senua, to follow the path to Surt. How 
will she get through? She'll need to find another way. The Northmen say that the defender of Muspel is called Sert. Yeah, I'm missing Almost three. Fire giants. His name means the Black One. Because he is like something burnt. Find that hard to believe. The Northmen believe that he sits at the border of Muspel with his flaming sword. I expected the, the other three the to be this way. Hmm. He will we, we will see. Asgard and Midgard, waging war against all the gods. He will be victorious. Uh oh. It's too far. She'll never find it. She'll never make her way back. She needs to remember the way back. What happens when she finds it? Everything will burn. Concentrate. Concentrate on where you're going. She needs to remember the path. Everything will burn. Then how will she find the way back? Ah, you could. Okay, if everything's on fire, you need to fucking hustle back. I get it. The Northmen made fire sacrifices, burning slaves like me to reveal the path to Surt. I searched for meaning in their suffering, in their eyes. But they just screamed like helpless pigs. Oh, don't act so surprised. You, you knew, you knew it was coming. He got bopped on the head. Do your gods answer your prayers, Senua? I asked the gods for mercy, all of them, even theirs. None answered. In the end, I set myself free. Defy the gods, Senua. Find your own path, like I find mine. My gods abandoned me. I am alone. Northmen of Hell worship the Devourers, insatiable gods of darkness. I come from Eren, Senua, where I once followed my own gods, the Tuatha de Danann. Why did you abandon your gods? Senua, I was a man of knowledge, not a warrior. To survive, I did things. Like you, Cinema. The man I once was has died. And when that happens, even gods you worship can die with you.
Hmm, this one's a little bit tricky. It is freaking hot in here, huh? Very hot. The bottom of the R shape should be a giveaway. Let's go back up into the house. Ah, shit. All right. Yeah, I wasn't even expecting that. It's lucky. The roof frames? Yeah, me too. Yep. That's the first thing that came to mind. I guess. There you go. All right. Here we go. That it straight through. E yep. What am I missing here? Oh, you just got to be 
Gotta be a little bit further back. Oh, okay. We we go on the long way. She ain't gonna die, relax. Well, she might. She might die. Yeah, she gonna die. Up. There's our fancy door. Three of them. Tell me, Drew. How did you escape your darkness? Once I found my purpose, I was no longer enslaved to the suffering I had to endure to reach it. Unclouded by fear, I could see it clearly in others. Even my captors feared the fire of certain. And so, during one raid, I took my chance and ran, knowing that they would not follow. A fool ran into the fire. <laughs> they left me for dead. Maybe they were right to. But here I am. Free. I'm glad I found you in the wilds. I wouldn't have made it without you. That looks pretty fucking good to me. There you go. TP.
That one was easy. Northmen believe that the world will be destroyed someday. They call it Ragnarok, the destiny of the gods. Asgard will be attacked by Surt and the fire giants. A monstrous wolf will swallow the sun, and the gods will fight in vain against their enemies. There is nothing they can do to prevent it, but Odin ever seeks knowledge and magic, hoping, hoping to find a way I mean, come on, make it a little bit more of a challenge than that. Okay, so that's where we're going. We're coming from here. Should have probably got to fight our way through again. Everything you see is it's how it's presented very minimalistic UI not even any um, fucking button pushes why am I on fire I'm sorry, what just the fucking happened? Teddy, was that... You know that. Was that an actual hint? And, and the only reason I ask, and it's okay to answer this... Just promise me. ...is because of the limited lives situation. Like, it was to far too easy to navigate. But we needed to, to go that way, I think. I will come back to you. Got it. Maybe it's intended. Mm, seems weird. No, nope, that was supposed to happen. Do 
Okay, I get it, I get it. Great fucking music too. He's burning. Now pick up his sword. have their time yet we still go on why I made a promise and I will go to hell to keep it I die free knowing you will carry my stories with you Face 
horror in the eye as I have to find your answers your quest The sword is gone. God damn it. Druth was a troubled man. A scholar turned slave. They tortured him. Took him with them on their raids. Drove him to madness. Spreading this new form of darkness to new ones. My world. Senua saw a deep connection form between the Northmen and the Darkmen. His tales of hell were true. Then that was the source of it. She learned everything she could from him. Until she too could see what he saw. Still find it very hard to believe we missed out on all that. Like three, three of them? Ah, that's an entire section we've missed. is shattered you simply cease to be though it may not seem that way to others you know when it is true you can feel it a stranger in your own body an imposter Oh, really, Crow? And she will do so again. You can be sure of that. I'll run I'll run back through real quick if it lets me. You may cross the bridge over the river of knives. I don't recognize this at all. Yeah, there's probably no way back, I think. <clears throat> Not from here, at least. But three in a row? That I wouldn't have missed that. The Northmen say that in the beginning there was nothing but darkness. Bitter cold to the north, fiery hot to the south. They say the cold formed. And ice, two in the last section? Maybe they're really well hidden. I don't even know if it matters. The power of the darkness gave life to the dripping ice. And the first giant was born. And was named. Emir. The ice continued to drip, and the power of the void gave life to it, and it became. Oh, I didn't mean to skip that. What the hell? I didn't mean to skip that. Yeah, I stopped chasing achievements uh, a long time ago. Spider-Man on PS4, I think, was the last game that I 100%ed. I mean, Isaac, of course, but... Anyone? There is no one here but me. Not you. Did you think that I would let you go? That you lost me back in the wilds? 
I will never let you go. You can't get rid of me. I am your shadow. And I will be watching when you draw your last dying gasp. I'm not ready to die. You will be when you see what they did to your dear beloved. Oh, he looks flayed. Man, yeah, it's not good. This waking nightmare. Where all dreams come true. You searched for control. A way to pull through. When you were in love, you left him in tears. To smother your fury. And banish your fears. But in darkness they came, through stormy black seas they raided these shores. Do you still hear his screams? And now, that you're home, he's so far Very away. strong. For having such a small frame, very strong. They've taken his soul. To these gods you cannot pray. They can break you, but not your promise. Even death won't keep you apart. Through his darkness you will find him in your sword still beats her heart. You fought for love unspoiled by your darkness within. You <clears throat> for your dreams. Now there's no way to win. In the head of his corpse lies the seat of his soul. 87% average completion? Holy shit. So you must carry his vessel to <laughs> bring him back home. I have like two or three. won't allow it so you will walk into the lair of the beast look it in the eye and you will go to war this is your mission this is your quest there is nothing else left I think it was a, a dream same as my uh, the hand had no rot on it in the dream as well or vision not exactly sure of the um if, if there is a difference at all oh we're way back here now progress only the gods made you a 
warrior for a reason. It's your calling. I wouldn't say the combat's easy. I've got it on the variable at, um, difficulty, which which may be changing things up a little bit. It's all timing, though. The biggest problem is probably identifying where threats are coming from. I'm going to keep doing that move. I like it a lot. Oh, it doesn't... It doesn't stun them, though. I just get yeeted somehow. Yeah, he doesn't like that. All right, fair. Yeah, if you do the leaping attack, he scoops you up with the shield. Told you to bring the flame guy's sword. No, didn't want that. Pyramid head, go! That one hurt. Oh, good. Yeah. That's one criticism. Sometimes the spawn points, which you cannot predict. Maybe they're maybe they're fixed. Maybe you can't predict them.
Them chads, Miss Queeb, them chads. Too fast, please. Get cornered now. I'll just hide behind here. He's holding his wounds, that's cool. He scooped me again. Pizza cake. His boat? His boat. This is our next puzzle component, I'm sure. Some kind of visual alignment or whatever. kind of butcherization of the uh the s we used to draw in school a real s and x align yourself to its secrets and you will find yours however you come to the gold covered bridge that leads to hell you may find it guarded by it's, it's not stussy no she will ask your name she will ask your lineage she will ask your business the Northmen tell of the warrior woman Brynhild, who leapt into fire and rode to hell to join her slain love Sigurd, and is challenged by the giantess. And that one's too easy. Makes you think of breast cancer, are oh, you? The ribbon, yeah, yeah, yeah. Little pink ribbon. It'd be interesting if it didn't give you the... You now it sort of like has the runes floating in the air when you're in that the right zone. Be interesting if it didn't have that. Uh, 
Oh, there you go. Look at that. Big surprise. Yeah. There's a new game, indie game, and I think it focuses on photography. And it's stuff like that within the game, but it's completely 3D and completely flexible. So each puzzle, there's no like one puzzle solution to line something up. You can think, what's the game where you have to shrink things and, and make them bigger based on perspective? think that but with photography in a physical world super liminal thank you yeah 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 now i don't know the name of this one i saw this a uh, while back it was announced i don't know if it's out or or what but It's even drawing my camera where I should be looking. That's... yeah. Cool, using the same piece for more than one. And now the breast cancer ribbon. That's the base of it there. And above it. Mm, could be up there. Oh, uses both. Yeah, that's that's too easy. That that could have been a lot more difficult. And I wouldn't have felt slighted. That's the thing. I I I love a well-designed puzzle. If it's too easy, it almost feels like the entire exercise was a waste of time. And I'm not, I'm not coming down on this game. Obviously, it's a work of art, but puzzles could do with, with some work for sure. Have I started seeing things on the environment like a real person with psychosis do? I mean, other than... The people hiding in trees taking pictures of me? No, no, everything seems pretty normal. Oh, there's a name for that. It was, a, it was an internet phenomenon years and years and years ago. It had a... It had a... What was it called? You appreciate that Senor doesn't do the very game thing of sliding down every ladder? To be fair, I haven't tried. <laughs> Tetris effect? No, it's something like... Uh, something like... Uh, like stealth hacking or... or so, it's, got, it's got that kind of word given to a group of people that think this thing is real um and it can it can be a very real form of a psychosis i guess i or, or paranoia leading to 
Do psychosis. Probably go that way. Okay, it doesn't doesn't look like it. I'll try the run button next. Nothing. Nothing. No, nope. rung by rung. Hella possesses large dwelling places in Helheim. Tall Later, Crow. Take it easy. I'm probably not far behind you tonight. I'm exhausted after watching Matrix this morning. Hunger. Her <clears throat> knife is famine. On her threshold, all will stumble. Her bed is called sick bed, and her bed hangings are called flames of a funeral. I really liked it, Teddy. I thought it was good. They say she is easy to recognize. However, you come to the gold-covered bridge that leads to hell, you may find it guarded by a giantess. She will ask your name. She will ask your lineage. She will ask your business. The Northmen tell of the warrior woman Brynhild, who leapt into fire and rode to hell to join her slain love Sigurd, and is challenged by the giantess. I think we're done here. Very much not normal. Uh, well... I can say that uh, while I, I haven't been diagnosed with autism, a lot of the, a lot of my behaviors in in real life are are not considered quote unquote normal as well. Just the bridge. Where's the giantess? Let's fight. Ask my business, ask my name, ask my lineage. I'll give you an answer. It starts with sweat, ends in ord. The gate is opening. It's coming. That song again. The source of the darkness. It's coming. This is your moment. Fuck yeah! What are you doing? You're showing weakness. You're not a warrior. You're a disgrace. The gods will punish you for this. Pick up the sword. Pick it up. Fight the darkness. Fight it. Get up. Get up. Get up and fight. Oh, that ain't good. Now we got a dagger. A wet dagger. Stormy seas and lost souls. She's dreamt of this before. They say dreams are visions of our memories, thoughts and fears. As seen by our inner eye. But what if each one of us is always dreaming? Even when awake? And we only see what our inner eye creates for us. Is this what hell is? A world shaped by Senua's nightmares? Maybe that's why people feared seeing the world through our eyes. Because if you believe that Senua's reality is twisted, you must accept that yours might be too. You fail the gods. You're pathetic. Rotten. Cursed. What were you thinking? Did you really think you could win? How stupid can you be? 
Everyone hates her. She's gone. Look at you. <clears throat> a warrior. Worthless. Weak. Pathetic. Go on. Feel sorry for yourself. Because there's no one left to do that for you. Everywhere. What's that? Take it. If you're too much of a coward to fight, then end the suffering. Broken and lost. Just Do like it. your sword. Go, Come on. There. <laughs> Why go on? When you give everything and face that which torments you. Only to find that it is worse than you could have imagined. Why go on? Is it really so weak to ask this? Or are we just so afraid of the honest answer that we do not dare pose the question? Sometimes the answer lies in a memory, a feeling, a song. The uh, war paint has flecked off. I love it. I love the effect. Because she fell in the water. I love how even the voices in your head can't decide what's going on. Cool. <laughs> Excuse me. Wow. fight with, with my little dagger. Her father Zinbel made sure of that. Only occasionally did she venture out on her own, collecting firewood and herbs, errands out in the Orkney Plains. That was her world. Like this one. Anyone that's played this, how long is a normal playthrough? Looks like we're around about a third of the way through ish. The 
gloom lifted. And for the first time in years, she felt a ray of hope. Six fucking great. Feels like you've been through everything already. Mm, I doubt it. Well, no, just based on the runes, we're in about the third or fourth area. Around 10 hours, but you also played around with photo mode. Okay, okay. So we'll probably stretch this out over a couple of streams. Day after day, Definitely coming back, though. Fucking it. amazing. Perfecting her own secret dance. Wishing those fleeting moments of light would stretch out to last forever. It's a trick. Oh. It's an illusion. It's not real. <laughs> Do you really want to believe it's real? You want to believe it's real, but it's a trick. <laughs> She'll be deluded. Where are you going? Where is she going? <laughs> what is she following? You can't even fight. It's just deception. How does he so effortlessly court the world and bliss? Only she could do the same. See the world through eyes anew. And dance with it. Just like he does. What's your name? Senua. I haven't seen you before. Senua. I'm not. I don't leave home much. Oh. I've been Senua. saying Senua. I have to go. Wait. Who taught you to fight like that? No one. <laughs> no one. Well, I I watched you, and you. Learned all of that from watching me. <laughs> you should become a warrior, you know. Me? I'm Lily. I'm here for the warrior trials. You should come and watch. And bring your sword. Dylan. You can't put it into words. That moment when you look into the eyes of the one who is supposed to reassure you. Make you feel safe. It only takes an instant. Fear swallows you before you have a chance to make sense of it. And darkness becomes a part of who you are. But her world changed the day the Northmen took him from her. Senua knows that there's no going back to how things were. That there's nothing to go back to at all. Stay still, stay quiet, hide, and don't tell her. Their gods can see into your mind. They will use this power to destroy you. I like this voice. Stop me. I can still feel him. Whatever's left of him, they will never let him go. I'm not gonna let him rot here. You're the one rotting here. Leave me alone. You will die here. No. And all your suffering will have been for nothing. Shut up! You want to believe it? Is he's he not real? Is he there? You're alone in these mountains. Is that Delia? Nothing lives here. You won't survive. 
You met him by the tree. She met him by the tree. Maybe it's a sign, the tree. What's he trying to tell you? He's waiting for you by the tree. Northmen tell of a great hero. Yeah, we got it. His name we got Sigmund. quite a bit to go. His father's hall was built around a great tree, and one day Odin comes and thrusts a sword I think, into the tree. I think we stop right there. Never can release it. That's a really cool game. You, you did good, Miss Queen. You did real good. Let's uh, let's do a BRB. Let's set up something different. Maybe try some different game. One second. Let me decide here. Get that volume back to a reasonable. I'm also going to try... This one. That was good. It's an experience. It's it's exhausting. Um, and I think that's what they were going for. But, but they hit it. They hit it out of the park with that. I can see why it's why it's uh, critically acclaimed. Won many awards. Bonus game. Alright folks, give me a sec. I'm also gonna run and grab Um New Beverage, head of the restroom. I'd I deserve it. I'll be back. Take my plate out. We'll run a quick ad break as well. No sweat, hobo. Take it easy. See you tomorrow. BRB.
turned. Let's try They Always Run. is a bit a bit unusual hey cop you're the one that's asking shit okay uh you mean harry the rat he sends his regards damn mutant he's a three arm you spilled my beer shall we dance RB to use a third, third arm and quickly move the mouse right stick towards the enemy. I'm I'm doing it. You broke the enemy's block. Finish him off with your sword. I'm tutorial man attack the enemy with your third arm before they can block when you're low on bioenergy your third arm attacks are weaker counter enemy attacks to regain energy blue flashing indicates you're going to get attacked counter attack an enemy the moment before it strikes yeah I get it Okay. Not this time. Get him, guys. You can hit up to three enemies at once with counterattacks. <laughs> Have I tried Steampunk Heist? It's an old game, yeah? Where's the rat? You know what game I want to play? Beyond Good and Evil. Did that... Did the sequel ever come out? Sorry, I just saw a giant pig man. I was like... Yeah. The text is way too fast. Woo!
Nothing to announce yet. Bummer. So I said this looked like flashback. It doesn't. <laughs> it's fucking ridiculous. What the fuck? Well, look, I'm just going to keep swinging. If you walk into me... Where's my sword? Ah, here we go. Swords can be used to attack and counterattack. So here's the deal. I don't want to counterattack. I'm not in the mood. Hopefully, it won't be a necessity. Did you find out who a guest is? He's an ordinary hunter boss. It says here he's dead. Don't believe the rumors. Damn, how did he get out? Get him! Uh. Stimpaks restores health. You can see how many stimpaks you have. Look for pouches to increase the number of stimpak slots. Okay. Controls. That's very basic. Late 2023. Wow. Wow. What's wrong with the connection? Hurdy. Woo! Yeah, I got a counter, I think. Oh, it's Mario. This just makes me want to play Mark of the Ninja. Oh my god, now there's the game. What the fuck? This is weird, dude. <laughs> Flashback, it is not. Oh, 
find a terminal, I'll see what I can do. Wait, am I finding the terminal? Or are you seeing what you can do? Camera movement hurts your eyes. Hundred bucks. Any ideas? Punch it. Need to find and break a power cluster. Give me a second. And done. Cyber Heart Element, one out of three. Collect three. Cyber heart elements to opponent increase increase your health by twenty five percent. Okay. gonna get you spend my cash i need a store i wonder if this is procedurally generated i'm guessing not i gotta smash everything that's that's the most important thing another hundred bucks six hundo run 
Don't raise the bridge. Oh, that's not very nice. Okay. Go that way, can I? I also can't go that way. What? What? Maybe, I, maybe I need to run my scanner. Can't stand on top of the pipe. What the fuck? Woo! 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 It's the title screen. What? Come on. Come on. I'm all for ideas, folks. You got them. You're not getting away. Yeah, I am. Motherfucker. Cheeky. All right. All right.
I don't know if I've ever made this clear before, but I really dislike games that make me parry as one of their main main things, main uh, player moves. It wasn't hold A to jump. You had to do it at the very, very last last minute. Um, but it hadn't taught us that before, I don't think. Oh, look, another section. Oh, God, okay. Virtually identical to the last one. Dodge that. Papa Neat, what is up, my dude? Thank you so much for the raid. Hello, hello. How's everyone doing? Inscription's pretty neat. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It is tied for third for my game of the year. I'm glad you're enjoying it, dude. It is uh, a delight to play. Tied for third? Tied for, tied for first with two others for my game of the year. want to get to a shop that's my main concern right now running in here as well. Cool, cool.
Tiger. Very thoughtful builders of this uh, facility to put uh, like just the right amount of ledges and little grates you can hang on to. It's it's cool. Not not so much for the security team. Probably a pain in their butt every day. But um, would be intruders definitely helpful. Stimpak pouch adds a Stimpak slot. Alright. It's gonna try to jump off the edge. What the fuck? We're back here again. Oh no! What do you think he was doing here? Judging by what's left of his equipment, he was a hunter like me. Hmm, wait a second, I pick up a weak sim signal from his body. Inspect him, maybe you can find out who and who he is and notify his relatives. Yeah, I ain't got anything better to do. It's all good. And my friend will have to lick liquidate anyone who came into contact with you. Isn't that right, Billy? Right, so, boss. And he won't give up, believe me. They don't call him Steel Jaw for nothing. They want them to suffer. Why are we still talking to God at boss over and out? Cool, we now have a visor. Scanner modifications to see wanted criminals. There was some lore there. Don't worry about it. Wanted. Bobby Joe. They have a bounty on their heads. Neutralize them and then send the coordinates of the body to the authorities for teleportation. What do you mean teleportation? What do you mean neutralize? DNA identified. Please step away from the body. Okay. Five hundred bucks. Oh hell yeah! You have to. I assume you have to know they're a criminal already before you attack them, right?
Do we have a map? Nah, who needs a map in a Metroidvania? We're good. No sweat, DT fish, take it easy. Cool. Nice one. Consciousness. All right. Fuck you. Rip the armor with your third arm. Cool. Yeah. So that was They Always Run. Cool little game there. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Let me go back to my library here real quick. Right click, manage. Like that one right there. Let's, uh. Oh, I know what. Fuck yeah. I'm gonna play some more Returnal. Shame. Shame, I was really hoping that that was going to be a, uh, what do you call it, a uh, more methodical sort of stealth action retro inspired game, but that's okay, that's okay, we have, we have other options there. Oh, PSN sale too? Oh shit, that's dangerous. Alright, let's go for... Um, let's go for a phase two run again. But this time... Um, we'll go to the ice stage. I missed it last night and I kind of regret doing that. Plus we took some... Less than ideal weapons, so.
Welcome back, Cat Template. Fuck off. Rude. Very. Oh, Jesus. Gotta get me a new weapon, bruh. Woof. Terrible room. Terrible handling of the room. Heal with adrenaline's the best upgrade. Mm. Nope. It's helpful, but it's not the best. Oh, Celine, what's up with that? Oh, you did it again. Oh, that was silly. Nah, <laughs> I don't know about that. It is heavily dependent on if we're able to find a decent weapon or not. No, you're good. You're good, cat template. You're absolutely good. Oh, a new one? Increases invulnerability time after getting hit. Oh no. Did I pick that? I didn't even pick it up. Key. Lovely. She saw something shiny at the bottom of the pit. Facts. That that has a tendency to happen with Celine. Yeah. Let's hold on to the keys until the very end, huh? I don't want to waste anything here. that room it's another key room hold on on that I might be better off just using the key over here yeah give it a shot was it worth it I 
hate fall damage. Even long falls. You still take long falls if you go into a secret room, which really fucking sucks. Where's my, uh... Button. Dash before you land. That'll do. It's the electric ball. Okay. Well, it, it works up close too. Was that we got trees oh hi I gets rid of shields good to know good to know wait for another Successful overloads reduce alt fire cooldown by three seconds. Are 150 bucks. Mm -hmm. Damn, those obelites disappear fast. Alrighty, well. Increases malfunction probability. You okay. Heal and... Wait, is that the same? No, different.
Mm -mm. I have to now collect many, many ether. Because uh, I'm out. I spent 10 bucks at the start on the, of the mission to buy an item. Which I don't even know how useful that's going to be. They are getting deleted so fast. Faster than normal, I think. Where's the other one? That's it there. Oh, I bounced it. Did I get it shield though? Yep. Nope. Yep. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, actually, luckily that... What protected me? If you get max, you get a shield now? Is that by default? Used to lose adrenaline like instantly previously. Very strange. Very strange. Locked, locked. Picking up a resin gives you a shield against the next hit. That's pretty good. Alright, what do we got? Another parasite? 
Increases protection, reduces repair efficiency by 30%. 15% protection is nothing to sneeze at. Hmm. No. Okay. Suffer damage when picking up items. Pass. So many egg sacks. It'd be kind of cool if there was a penalty, or not necessarily penalty, but a consequence for not killing them when you have the chance. Like maybe something hatches out of there, I don't know. Level 17 already? Nice. Five percent weapon damage for every two hundred obelites carried. Maximum bonus plus fifteen percent. Stairs. Spaceman. This time Spaceman and Heal, I think. But Spaceman's a must-have. What else we got? got the boss room we could just try running up there don't need to fight the boss we can probably skip it
despite it being one of the most incredible bosses I've ever fought in any video game. No damage taken. That's the most important thing. We are fine, dude. That, that parasite we've got is doing its job. A lot of malignant shit lying around. Feels like a tree. Obelite extractor learned. Ah, uh, fuck. Okay. Repair and oh, it's only repair enhancer. Uh, still, blood cedar. What this? We 
got very lucky there without with not taking damage. Definitely hit me once. Unfed pod. 20% stagger power for each attached parasite. That sounds really powerful. Parasite. Never forget the first time enemies spawned in that room, I shit myself. Like, that's not supposed to happen. I think my shield is going to protect me from that. Not at all. Alright. Much longer, Jash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. bad guys here either? I don't believe it. Yeah, okay.
Really? No bad guys? Come on. This room always have bad guys in it. This room will have a bad guy in it. Ah, oh, fuck. The worst one. Rip space man, that cost me 250 bucks to fight that. Fuck. Guess I'll take that. It's all right. They did. Yep. They did. Very recent update, actually. Weapon damage, 300. Hmm. me off. It doesn't get rid of the shield, huh? Need shield breaker or... Damn parasite is kicking my ass. Everything's malignant. Everything. You're not. I can only shoot twice. Really? Very red. Parasites we got. Reduces melee damage? Yeah, do it.
greatly increases melee cooldown and dash cooldown. Mm, pass on that. Triggers two malfunctions upon detach. Gain shield against the next three hits. Two malfunctions. Aye. Have I have one of those already? Okay. Get out of photo mode. Um, why am I only shooting two at once? Is it because of it's because of web? Yeah, it's shooting. It's like I get it. Okay, you're oh. good, I guess. Great room. That was what, five? I think five ether. Great room. Maybe the other one's more damage. Maybe. Eh, I can't tell. This has a ton more bonus damage, I guess. Pretty concentrated. Plus the double shots does sound fucking badass. Shocking springs? No, no, no. Challenge room? What else we got? Protected. Grab this. See the only one left? Two of these. Uh, 
Alright, good. <gasps> what was that? Head up. That's an end game weapon. Oh, yeah, okay. Hardened increases protection, successful hits repair your integrity. Fires faster the longer the trigger is held. Zoe's sleeping. Why do I collect stuff before fighting? Um, to ensure my max health goes up. Protection. Repair efficiency. Uh, I'll save a little bit more and we'll go back and get weapon damage, I think. We kind of have the best weapon in the game. Well, one of. It's very unlikely that I don't take damage in a room like that. So whenever I get the opportunity, I get as much health as, as possible. As fast as possible. Because when your health is at max, if you pick up another regular heal, it turns into a resin. And we happen to have, um, when we obtain a resin, we happen to have a, uh, an augment that gives us a shield from damage. By 42, wow, okay, so I can get protection and weapon damage? Okay. Where was that weapon damage one? It wasn't too far back, was it? Make the room your weapon by stacking. It's decent. And it bounces off enemies. And if it gets stuck to enemies and enemies are flying around, like it moves with them. It's, it's pretty good. But you can't not take leech rounds whenever you find it. It's... It's way too good to leave behind. Leech rounds ensure as we stay at or near max health. Right, let me see here. Where was that? Creepy house. 
Guess that one there. Yeah, that may be it. Yeah, and I think I have a key too, right? So I used to get real greedy talking about that health situation where I'd leave stuff behind and um, not pick it up until the very end of the starting floor. But it's better to collect as you go now, I think. One, you're going to spend like two or three hours on the first floor and that's while that's kind of fun to work in an efficient manner like that, it's it gets tiring. So just collect as you go. Don't get hit. Or if you do, have a, a heal like we have. So so remember how you said earlier, um, healing on... Where? Back. Uh, healing on weapon proficiency. Or, or leech on weapon proficiency is one of the best items it, you're not wrong it's one of the best but having the weapon augment itself is yeah it's it's unbeatable best best upgrade in the game that is not it shit where was it it's gonna bug me now way back there maybe yeah maybe maybe that's where we just came from like it okay the only other thing left is like a blue door somewhere couple blue doors. Do we have a key? We do. Alright. Save the key? That one's not going to be worth it. I know it. I just, I feel it. Oh, Zoe, you snoring. You tired. Oh, and don't forget. Ah, oh, shit. Um. Do you want to do the boss? Fuck yeah. Let's do it. I wasn't going to, but since we have a healy bed, um. And I have leech rounds, there's, there's no reason not to. Still wish I had my spaceman, but we should be fine. Such a waste.
Yeah, we should be stunning on a lot of our hits as well. Quite good. I just can't not fight this guy. He is... Wait, what's this? Why do we have an elevator here? Oh, okay, what do you got? Positive effects of parasites. Don't think I don't see that. Up we go. And then we'll come back. We'll go to the ice stage. If I am not feeling the ice stage, we'll skip it. But we have to at least go there. Oh, right. Plus, we also need to get... We need to fight bosses for a chance at winning a uh, data cube. Still need three of those. You gonna have me go from there? New rune layouts, man. I like it. so weird because I don't like him in Isaac. <laughs> A worm calibrator. <laughs> How do we find the... It's in databank, I guess, right? Sk uh, artifacts? Artifacts? No. Xenoglyphs. Here we go. All right. We got 15 of 15 here. So we need 7 from 10 in the ice zone. Another 5 in the final zone. And we've got to get the slice of pizza. That's the most important thing. And I'm going to search until I fucking find it. Undying. Great to see you. Interstellar music? Not quite. Look how much I'm healing for. I wasn't kidding before when I said it's the best upgrade in the game. Ow. That's unnecessary.
I can't remember if I fall flawlessed him or not. Pretty sure I did. Old, old Hyperion, not not new Hyperion. Vertical Barrage is probably the one of the weakest. What you got, son? Phantom Limb. Yeah. All right, so now we're pretty much uh, unkillable. I'm, I'm pretty sure I've done I've done the entire first zone uh, zero damage before um, and I'm pretty sure it, not this is the third zone but fourth zone sorry zone one um, but I'm pretty sure I've done him no damage as well anyway uh, we got phantom yeah we like I said we're pretty much unkillable now No data cubes, though. Bummer. Oh, right. We're going this way. Hang on. Greatly increases max integrity. Dropped obelites disappear one second faster. Go on. Go on. Spoil yourself. Cinder, what's up, dude? I fucking hate this zone. So we, the good news is, if we're having trouble, we can pretty much skip straight to the third zone by jumping in that whirlpool right there. New? Alright, good. I'm gonna leave that there. We're gonna come back for that. Ah, oh, shit. We're gonna refill on health first. Oh, I can get up top now. Fuck. That's the reason I hate this level. Those guys. Oh. 
Oh, okay. Fuck me. so much Just trying to survive here. That's all. I haven't actually been up here before, I don't think. Maybe. Doubles light collection radius increases chance of finding malignant items. Whatever. Reduces protection by 10%. Mm. Don't do it. Item. I worst zone for this reason because of one enemy. There's there's worse ones here. There's very dangerous like mini bosses and stuff, but compared to them, cakewalk. I had armor piercing rounds. It might be better. Maybe.
I should have used the bed in the first zone before. Eh, whatever. I'm repiercing rounds, make short work of them. Um. Nice. Not, not nice. Not nice. Okay, we're good. Cool. I feel like everyone played this for a week tops then never went back to it i um i played it for about two months month and a half about that and then uh because i'd completed it i'd cycled a few times like there wasn't much in it for me but i i don't know now i'm in a collectathon or i kind of want to run around and get some of the stuff we missed out on and it's a roguelike so every run's going to be fresh different builds every time yeah, it's good. A PS5 exclusive, by the way. Another parasite. Reduces proficiency rate by 15%. Nope, nope, that ain't worth. What do I think is a longer... Is longer this game or Hades? I'm sorry, define longer. <laughs> Can runs in Hades last five hours? No, no problem. damage while you have a malfunction. Lame. the feeling of this room. Fuck yeah, 8 out of 10. Nice. It's been worth it just for those. Weapon damage? I'll fire cooldown protection. Okay. You think a Hades run is nine or ten minutes tops? <laughs> Watch out, folks. We got a badass in chat. I think you asked me that question just so that you could respond with that.
It's been around nine or ten minutes of a run making decisions. Oh, at least. At least. I'll spend nine minutes deciding what weapon I want to use. This is a really big fucking level. Actually, they they all are in their in their own way. Some are some are definitely smaller, but they're they're if you explore enough, they're quite fast. Runs can be that short if you don't get through all the early. <laughs> right, you could die in zone one, sure. See? Now, that's... that's bait. Let's do it. Oh, fuck. Good though. That's the first part done. Need a key for that. Oh, why are you so far away? Oh, we went through a zappy door, didn't we? Okay. That's cool. I think most of my Hades runs end up being around about an hour long. Yeah, about 90 minutes an hour. room here. 
tough. It's real tough. Who's the boss here? I cannot remember that. It's not the bird. Who is it? doing I will wait as long as eternity to reach it uh don't jump down there by the way is that wait is that water water never mind Jump down there if you want. They've, um, I think they've nerfed leeching rounds, by the way. Which is fair. It deserves that. Room. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, it hasn't locked me in yet. Okay, hi. Oh, you're here too? Okay, no sweat. I was wondering what was freezing me. Oh, we ain't done.
Okay, not bad. <sighs> Two of them? Oh, that's so good. Why you do this? Okay. Like I would like the other one? Eh. Whoa! Golden coil again. And that would be pretty good, I guess. Uh, third zone might be... Might be actually okay. Did I get this one? Yeah. Not okay. Not okay. Much danger. Do we need to be here right now? We got no keys. Underwater's the goal. I may not survive that, so I'm gonna go back. Boosh. Okay, so we're looking for, and if anyone knows what it looks like, where it is, Cat was helping me yesterday. Um, it is a... What did, what did we find out? It looks like it's a chest hovering in the middle of nowhere. It's a secret room. It's a secret room off of a normal room. What else? Uh... Three pillars are inside it, and it's before we go down the big drop. So that was that was the mistake I made yesterday. And at least we have a decent weapon this time. Settle down, big guys. Challenge room. Challenge rooms are tough as shit down here. We may leave that to last. If at all. Beat Nemesis? Which one is Nemesis? That's a Final Fantasy X super boss. Ah, uh, this fucking dickhead problem. Oh shit.
No, penance, not nemesis, idiot. Get it right, Queeb. Got him. Get that cash. So see the little blue flying things coming off my weapon? That's because my adrenaline meter is at 5 right now. One of the first ones you pick up are little homing helpers that come off of your weapon. It's really cool stuff. What are the purple things on these things? So this is a, a chunk of gold, obelite, money. This is a resin which will help me get max uh, HP. I'm not going to take either of them because they're malignant, which means we have a chance to gain a malfunction if we pick that up. I don't want that. You can do decent malignancy runs. Um, so here, for example, I'm going to cleanse this. We're going to open it up. Child's watch. Fucking awesome. That's an extra life. So look, three platforms, right? But I don't think this has anything to do with what we we're talking about before. Don't be enemies, don't be in. Fuck you. Is there a big ball? There's a there's a teleport sphere down the bottom. But that's not the ball that I was thinking of. This one here. That just takes me back up the top. Yeah, it's nothing. I think the other ball that you're thinking of is the little... It's much smaller than that. And you shoot it and platforms appear. Um, but we can take a look down here. It's a lore room by the looks of it. So there's the one you shoot that helps you get to places. I've been in here tons of times. Next to a main room, it's invisible on the map and there's a chest nearby. Okay. Bad shield breaker. Then I don't think it's here. Fuck you. Oh no. It's all right, Celine. Don't worry about it. You got this. Just at the bottom of here. Nah, nothing here. I'll find it. I ain't going down that hole and oh, uh, this time. I'm making that mistake again.
the killing potential here and to learn hyper accurate as well We've got armor piercing payload rising pitch fuck no leech rounds no leech rounds armor piercing is so strong All right, we'll see, we'll see. Nothing off the, off the map yet. This is pretty standard stuff. But it's off a normal room, huh? Fuck. Oh no. Where's the heal? This ain't good. Ah, oh, no. Oh, for fuck's sake. Leech rounds back. That was a tough room, man. Sucks to leave this weapon behind, but um, gotta be done. Where was it? Is that it? That's it.
perform six melee kills with low melee damage fuck that ain't good either uh i'm just gonna use the nullification sphere which means we're gonna get ourselves another what do we got resin resin Still from Big Heal. Okay. Such a waste. But gotta do it shouldn't have left this weapon behind in the first place that's that's on me I can't remember what happens when you collect three, but yes, something something bad does happen. Doesn't help that there's enemies that can just give them to you if they hit you. It really sucks. Oh, speaking of, that guy. Don't you... Okay, so obtaining a resin slot or getting a resin slot filled with regular Silphum doesn't give you the shields. Makes sense. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, that's just ridiculous. That, that is really ridiculous. Um, shit. Phasing rounds two, once we learn it. Sounds like we're going to need it if I'm not taking my other weapon. We are covered in parasites. I think we got five now. Uh, no, if you fall to your death, that is, uh, there's nothing down there. Well, quote unquote death.
Okay, let's go right and left first. Can you put it? No, you have to find it. You cannot change the stats. You have to find weapons with it. And leeching grounds cannot be on every weapon. They're specific. for a chest out in the middle of nowhere with an orb nearby. I should have gone up. I should have ridden that the whole way. It's another room I hadn't seen before. I wonder if there's any other way up there. I should have rode that all the way up. There's a couple of heels and another item up there. I was like, oh, cool, a chest. And then I got the chest and then that was bad. Unless the little elevator bit got reset. That looks like it's gone. Nah, it's gone. We should still be healing when we when we do kills, right? Oh yeah, phasing rounds too. Unlock a stronger version for the next time you find a better weapon that has it. I'm not sure how the the grades of those go, but I believe so. Something like that, yeah. Am I healing or not? I'm not healing, am I?
Fucking hell. I had nowhere to run. Back down to two. I just keep spending. On junk, no less. Not even anything of value. Okay, what do we what do we got here? I think I'm gonna I'm thinking I'm gonna regret using those early. Just just give me that pizza slice, that's all I want. Okay, so I don't know about the, the chest, but that right there might be what we're looking for. There's, a, there's gonna be a big bat in here. I know it. Yeah. It just screams, fuck you. And it's one that can give us, uh. Give us malfunctions too. Tough, tough enemy. Um, is this it? Is this what we're looking for? Downstairs. I am very well hidden right now. Coming up? No, he's directly beneath me though. I only have to hit him once to mark him. It'll take a while. He's pissed, you can tell. I mean, wouldn't you be though?
shoot the orb. Doesn't do anything. This has phasing rounds. They've nerfed phasing rounds too. Probably for the best, if I'm being honest. This is literally what this weapon's designed for, so don't hate me. This is post nerf. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I hate be dead by now if we had the original. Fuck me. I should have stayed up there. Tiles watch gone. So fucking dumb. Acid clouds. It's tough. It's really tough. They've made it a lot harder. Way less damage, yeah. Yep. What was the chest up there? Oh, it was one on the other side. Yeah, okay, we'll go back up. He's a he's a prick, that guy. Just fucked. And we gotta open three containers just to get rid of this now. Hostiles leave behind acid pools. Oh great. It's one of the worst uh Two artifacts. This is going downhill real fucking fast. I, sh I shouldn't have left my weapon behind. <laughs> or when I say a line like, there's an enemy in that room, listen. Listen, Queeb. Alright, where are we going? Is that the... That's the exit. That is the exit right there. Um, yeah, we won't even drop down, I don't think. Unless there's a way to get... Back up to here. Uh, no. No, I'm still looking for something. I'm 
Unless it's not here. I guess that's another possibility. Is the pizza slice on every on everyone? Seventy damage per. No, so I was only hitting him every every once in a while. Can it be past the challenge room? Yep, yep, it could be. I forgot about that. Hey. You get leech rounds. Keep leech rounds. The fuck do I get back up there? Don't tell me that was a one-way trip. No way. No, no, no. There's a teleport there. That is a teleport not to where we want to go, though. Hang on. Ah, oh, here we go. Walk every wall before that? These things don't have walls. I thought we were looking for a chest floating floating in the middle of nowhere. Hello, forgetful. What's going on? off the map we would see chests here we, we would see them Fuck off. Oh, we don't... We don't even have the laser beam under here. It's something else.
It's this dickhead again. Yeah, it's been severely nerfed. And that's pretty good. I like that. Protective pylons, blade harmonized. Nah, nah, nah. Gross. It seems to create a positive relation between ether and protection. All right. <sighs> Off for work. Two weeks starting tomorrow. Right on. Sounds fun too. But as for other places to visit, this ain't it. Where are the two other rooms over here? Contained. I need to see a video. Uh the things that what's it called fragments Several platforms jutting out from a rock wall is tucked underneath one of the platforms overhangs is a blue orb. The orb sits at a strange angle, but once players find the right angle and activate it, a series of platforms. A room containing several platforms. I need the fucking I'm gonna search that on YouTube. It is the three pillar room. Okay. All right, let's do a little bit of exploring back there then. right there. Seems to be on the back side. Let's see if we can work it out before I look at the absolute solution here.
Isn't that the exact location I went before, though? Pretty sure it is. It is a bunch of platforms. All right, give it a shot. Hey, legit. Give me the slice, I'll be on my way. We did see a couple of other platforms somewhere, didn't we? it is in there. Alright, I'm gonna have to have a look. completely different room, one that we cleared out possibly. Come on, bud. Just give me a map location. At the very least, he's not saying, what's up? It's your boy. Now he's going through to the exit. And then people are saying it can spawn in different locations. God damn it. Data cube. I have to take it home. The sun is fixed. Nope, that's it. That's down it's down the hole. What a stupid video. I'm going to explore that room just because we're here, but I don't think it has anything to do with it. I'm surprised every single guy had mentioned it. Good.
The sun is fixed. Oh, Celine. No, you tell me. I'll start heading back. If you've got another solution, I'll give it a shot, but time to move on again. That's right, underwater there is no teleports. What's interesting is this weapon has Oh, the former weapon we had. I'm, I'm not going to read an article in the middle of a stream. Bad enough I'm looking up YouTube videos. So top right is where I'm heading right now. Your three pillar room is right here. Taking that with. I need it. I need it bad. Like, I, I understand that it can move around each one, and that's why it, some people were frustrated trying to find the ciphers, because you can't do it in one cycle. But, um... If I if I know the if I know at the very least a room can spawn like it's guaranteed to spawn the room every map that'll make me feel a little better. We get up there. Okay. Uh, now it don't, doesn't matter if we win or lose. We need to go back home first. So that's one more cycle at least. And then we have to go all the way back to the final boss in this zone after that. I think that's how it works.
hopefully we get an artifact inside as well. I, uh, I, we died. We died. No, no freebie here. into another fight again. Fuck you. I was in the process. I was in the process of firing that. Yeah, I think I will not take more malignant items in the future. Um, that sounds like a bad time. I'm not fighting that. God no. I got enough. I got enough on my plate right now. Can the red glowing things be switches? No, it's all decorative. This is not even on the map. Removes a random parasite. Could be good. Entire builds can be formulated on, um, like adding and removing parasites. Same with malfunctions, actually.
I'd say that's that was worth it. Ah, that's our boss there. Why didn't I go up there? Because we're in, we're still in the same room. We haven't explored this yet. Barely hitting him, he seems to be somewhat stuck. Oh. Fucking hell. Can you not, sir? Please. This is a cluster, dude, like... To say this is more difficult than the last time I played it... Understatement of the year. Oh. Fabricator costs increased, or oh, whatever. Problem is the third one we're gonna get if we come up against another one of those. Aye. <gasps> it's not bad. Two ciphers from this zone, and of course, the pizza resistance. I do have a key, right? I do. One fixed. Nice. Bad guys. Not bad guy. Disables all turrets. Guess what we don't have down here. I'll, I'll give you a moment to, to come up with an answer. not worth is it the t it is the turrets have you played this before
Why is that like that? And why is that there? Where are we? Doorway there. All right, let's have a look. And a chest directly beneath, I think. Solomon, it is an incredible game. It is incredibly difficult. But I do love it so much. Thank you for making the noise before you attack. I like it. I like it a lot. I still have a key. Like a more realistic Metroid? Nothing bad's gonna come for me up this way. Free of fuck off. <laughs> Just fucking stupid tough man. <laughs> so difficult. Yeah, cool.
Oh lord, he coming. Fucking. Oh. You lose, um, you lose an artifact. It's a fact. What time is it? 426. We've been streaming for 10 hours let me stop my recording real quick <laughs> 